what's up? Welcome in. I'm just getting things situated here. Let me uh, get that off the screen. Uh, continue, yeah? I haven't done anything, so. There we go. Close that out. Hopefully Twitch wants to work today. Awesome. Audio okay? Where are we at? We're at... Well, we're still in Rifted. Of course. Okay. Tell her she'll have it. Maven is one of the uh, speak to Sibby in the gym. We have to do that. Yes, my lady. I will pass the good news on to her. Search the thief's body. On midnight's week. Are we still meeting later? That's interesting. Combat training? I don't think we're going to be doing that. Of course. That. Your training isn't... Uh, but Will, Will Landry gave me a couple things to do. Then. Deliver Harold's sword. I forgot to do this. This is towards the end of yesterday. I think we were like... Eight and a half hours in at this point. I was. Sounds good. Thank you. Thank you. We have a gem. And I still don't know if we're tough enough to take on that bandit leader yet. We may investigate this. Oh, and we want to do Bleak Falls today. Visit the Rift and Fishery. We could do this. He, he's. You know. He doesn't mind doing fishing. Um. Imperial dogs. There is nothing yes. to for them. Jurassic, what are you from, my dear? Interesting NPCs, huh? I don't know if I've ever seen her here before. But I think we've already sold everything off. Um, there. Time. The PMs, huh? Just looking for player houses to throw in. You know, that's one thing I skimped on with this. Considering I'm running the anniversary edition of the game, uh, you don't really need extra play. I mean, aside from the vanilla stuff plus hearth fires. I've been looking for you. Oh, got something I'm supposed to deliver. Looking for me. Your hands only. Okay. Let's see here. Looks like that's it. Got to go. 10 XP, huh? What do you give me? There's a mod that I wanted to add dinner invitation um yeah we never read the letter to ron we had to kill him ron i told you if you tell me to get away from you one more time i said we're done oh if you tell me to get away from you yeah yeah uh you didn't listen and now we're done it's all very convenient for you when i'm snuggled up in your blankets at night isn't it and as soon as something i want as soon as it's something i want it's Get away from me, get away from me. Yeah, I swear you say that so much. One of these days, you're going to end up enchanting something with it by accident. I hope you do. I hope it leaves you, too. I'm going to go... Uh, I'm, I'm going up to join uh, Hajvar. He's a real man, and his sword's twice the size of yours. <laughs> Not that it matters. All I wanted was a damned hug. Your former lover, Varava. Okay. We, uh, we really don't need that. Uh, a dinner invitation. Yeah, this seems to be the only thing we didn't read. Reverian, you have been cordially invited to dinner and drinks at Blood Chill Manor. As an honored guest, you're encouraged to come early and mingle with the other attendees. When you're ready to feast, ask the house waiter for a menu and he will let you into the banquet hall. The finest and most delectable dishes will be on display. There will be no need for appetizers. Once everyone is ready and seated, a full course awaits. Come for the dinner, stay for the drinks. I don't really like that seal. Something seems a little suspicious about that. And I just realized we're, we're carrying like way too many things. Um, let's see if we picked anything up. Yeah, like Canis Root. I'm sure there's a few more. We, we need to make more potions. I need a, I need a little... A little more money. We need to replenish some. Damn faithless uh, Every one of them. Oh yeah, the message to Sibby. So yeah, starting a, a little bit later than I would have liked to today. I had a doctor's appointment earlier. 
and uh, semi forgot about it. Interesting. Uh, hey there. Hey, you're not supposed to be down here. Official business only. Oh, I sort of unofficial business. Yeah, I'm allowed to be here. Oh, my mistake then. Sorry, you can go on ahead. Yeah, there's no way we're paying. Interesting. And uh, close the door. Huh. Important. The crazy Khajiit in cell one is not to be disturbed. He paid us good money for that cage, so don't go bothering him. If he's still in here in a month, I think we should enforce a little rent increase. Adele will get the chance, though. You've all seen the way he looks. Won't be surprised if he tries to end his life soon. If you see him in a particularly suicidal mood, get in there and stop him. He's been using the key we gave him, so if you need to get in there in a hurry, use the spare in the broken strongbox above the fireplace. A dead man can't pay rent. And the warden! Oh, the lighting in here seems re oh, wow, that's really good. Interesting. I thought there was somebody else in there, and then it's just the loot. Uh, that's gotta be Maven's kid. To himself? Well, yes, I suppose it can be. You're looking for a particular one. It's a small mage tower near the necro necromancer on the road to Falkreath. It's a mage tower? Oh, it's on the lake. Uh, Telnata? Oh, welcome in. Not really awake yet, but I'm lurking for you. Thank you. I'm uh sorta of still waking up. I had, a, I had an appointment this morning, and then um now I'm uh I'm on my second cup of uh, herbal tea. Yeah, no worries. Uh, it's called Muriel or Morel Bismuth. I've never even heard of that one. Are you sure you don't want me to release you, Mr. Dragonfly? You no. still... How are you ever going to meet Mrs. Dragonfly stuck in there? He's still talking to him. That's weird. Have you come to gawk at me, or is this a social call? Uh, I was actually sent by Louis Latrush. Ah, let me guess. He wants his horse. Well, that's going to be a bit of a problem. See, I don't really outright own so you're saying you don't own the horse you already sold to, to Latrush? That is correct. You see, Frost belongs to the Blackbriar estate. Technically, everything in the estate is owned by my mother, Maven. My plan Mama was to take Bear, the horse from in. our lodge and deliver it to Latrush at the stables. Inigo is my favorite follower, exactly too. Um, I've tried them all. Still, I don't want all to the custom the followers. Trush. Still, none Tell of them hold what. a candle to uh, to Steal the horse and deliver it, and you can have the his um half of the his plug-in needs to be cleaned. It's not a uh... yeah. Just you could run it through the quick auto clean. Takes you know literally a second or two, but yeah, you got to clean it. And uh, his quest obviously isn't finished, but I don't think we're getting a version three. So. Yeah, you know, uh, I bet Maven would pay me even more for this information. Since she owns it and all, you know? Sure, take advantage of the guy in jail. Okay, fine, I can make <laughs> the deal sweeter. I obviously don't have anything here, but there's a Caladran, welcome in. The lodge, and I did manage to hold on to the key. Take it. Alright, so let's 
I don't know, the music seems overly loud. Maybe it was because I was in third person, or maybe it's just the track. Ah, finally! Someone beside the stupid guards. Maybe it was third person, I don't know. So, tell me why you're in jail. Look, we all have our flaws. No, I think it's the Mine musical track. Women can't get enough of me. So, I had this little affair. I have that problem, too. I was betrothed to beautiful. I completely uh, empathize Bat with her situation, Sidney. finds Sydney. out and she tells her brother Wolfram that her brother attacks me with a knife. I had to defend myself. Yeah, yeah. So you got arrested for his murder. Exactly. Now I have to stare at these bars for eight months. Can you believe it? I was about to let that wench marry into the richest family in Ripton. I know, it would have been a good deal she for her. pays me. I'd do anything to have that whore's head on a platter. Yeah, well, All maybe I, I could help you out with that. She is. All right. Yeah, I'll help you find her. She sounds like a whore. Ah, that's the spirit. Find her, and I promise you'll be well compensated. All right. So, I got it. You're only serving eight months. I mean, you're you're a black briar. Kind of makes sense. Only eight months though. Mother thought I should be taught a lesson for yeah. airing the family's dirty laundry in public. I mean, I've taken. Care yeah, look, he's got the nice bed. He's got the the, the wardrobe, what the big table with the feast, me the painting. Ah, well, at least I have all the comforts at home. And I never really looked, but I don't see any copies of the Lusty Argonian made in here. They probably should be. All right, tell me about your family. When speaking of the Black Briars, only one thought. Should Help us, you end up rich. Cross us, and you'll end up a memory. Is that enough information for you? Oh, I get it. So do you have any information on this Sfidi? She was a young woman, buxom, with long, flowing black hair. Ah. She used to sing the most lovely songs. A man of refined taste. Never heard a voice so beautiful. All that talent will go to waste when I'm finished with her. Yep, too bad. So if uh, if Maven already threw you in jail, why steal the horse? I'm not stealing anything. Besides, some jail time isn't going to make me roll over and play dead. All right, fair enough. When I find that bitch, I'm going to wring her little neck. Yeah, it may happen sooner than you uh, sooner than you thought. So, like, all right, we're level 12. We're halfway to, uh, almost. Is that you that was talking? No, we can't break in there. I don't even think my knock skill will get in there. I didn't take out animated clutter. Forgot about it. Uh, I literally didn't do anything. So, the same mods we were running yesterday, we're running today. Animated clutter is one of those mods that you can... You can remove safely. Hi. I'm, uh... I'm just gonna look in the strong box there. Yeah, you saw nothing. Go about your business. I decided to throw in a go in here. Uh, he's the only follower I added. Aside, you know, aside from the interesting NPCs. I forgot there's a, a first person animation for that. Yo, you have ebony. And try to get all three because they do clip through the floor. I only got two. Uh, turn my light off here. Now we need the light on. Can't see him. Uh, Come to kill me at the last, have you? Thank the gods. So if I turn my quick light off, how's no can you see him with the just the face light? No, it's probably better if I turn the quick light on for you guys. Strudel, and what shenanigans are we up to? We are well. We delivered the message from Louis to Sibby, and we're also going to help Sibby find that uh, girl that he was dating that. Uh, he killed her brother, so Sfidi. And while we were listening and talking to him, we heard this guy talking, so we decided to come have a chat with him. I know I must die, 
Beware, though. Yeah, the guards wrote a note saying you were suicidal. I defend myself. I'm not gonna attack you. Why? Do you know me? I am in no mood for jokes. Strike me down. Take your revenge. Hello to everyone who's entered. <laughs> oh, you're able to see him fine with that? Does it look does it look better though? Without the quick light? Or with the, I think with the quick light, you guys would be able to see more of the room, right? Because I'm watching on my phone. Like the quick light's kind of a fail safe. Oh, I'm sorry, the uh, the face light. Too many too many words with the, with the word light. And and more of him, right? Yeah, and he's been he's been retextured. I got a I got a separate non high poly. Uh, but he looks good. So I have no clue what you're talking about. And who are you in the first place? Why do you have a bow attached to you already? You don't remember? I, I... Uh, that is my fault also. I am your so-called friend, Inigo. I was the one who killed you. I tried anyway. I am guilty. Kill me. Hmm, are you part of the ambush? You didn't do a very good job, did you? So why are you sitting here in jail? After I shot you, I finally realized my mistake and tried to turn myself in. Your body was gone. The guards did not believe me. They said I was wasting their time. I had to pay them to put me in this cell. Yeah, no worries, Drew. This is where I belong. I needed to repent. I need to repent. Well, I'm uh, I'm not the person you remember, but you look kind of useful. You've got ebony. You I like are that. the person I remember. I would recognize your smell anywhere. My life is yours to take. Do it. How about we uh, just agree to disagree, and I can kind of use some help if you're willing. I I can spring I you from here. You? Yeah, yeah, Inigo. Don't waste your life rotting in here. Or die. Defending you. Yes, I accept. I feel lighter in my heart now you have given me this opportunity. Mm -hmm. You will not regret this. I have the feeling I'm going to regret this. Yeah, watch where you aim that bow of yours. Do not joke about such things, my friend. The sadness I feel for what I have done is brutal. Enough. Even the eye, like the eyes, for are different now. too. Mr. Dragonfly, say hello to my friend. Mr. Dragonfly is shy and frightened of almost everything. Yeah, music's only at half. It's got to be these tracks that are playing. Specifically in the jail. Once we get out of here, it's going to be different. So... Uh-huh. Uh... You mind if I ask you something? You have my full attention. What's up, hybrid? Uh, so tell me about yourself. I'm very stealthy, if need be. Alright, you're stealthy. I like Skyrim very much, to oblivion with those who don't. I can talk without moving my lips. You can talk without moving your lips. Alright, let me ask you something I else. Alright. An exciting subject. Combat. Let's see what he's doing now. So, what are you? What are you doing currently? I am being aggressive. You're aggressive, huh? And in battle, I am fighting how I choose. All right. I think his aggression is probably fine. All right. Let me ask him. I gotta leave him at that. We'll leave him default. Okay. I don't really see the need to change him. We're not a stealth character, so uh, no need for him to be stealthy. But he's stealthy enough. We'll see about how far... If he starts pushing me and stuff like that, it depends. Um, anything else for combat? Let me see. Alright, no, that's the only thing in there. Tell me about your past. My brother and I never knew our real parents. We were found abandoned in his... Do you have any issues with the app? Mel, did you get that sorted, by the way? About the account? We melted his heart with our fuzzy I went and looked. I was looking, um... And he carried 
last night, last night before I went to sleep, and then I was looking this morning before I, uh, I had to hop on the telemedicine call. But I was doing that for an hour, but, um, so in here, I'm only able to see, like, I have, like, a list of, like, everybody that follows me, like, with their, their names and their accounts. But I, I remember, like, when it happened, like, when you subbed, it was, like, the same name. Although it was from your, you were saying it was from, like, your other machine or whatever. But the name was the same. So, it just says, like, Acid Rain. So I don't know, like, you're gonna have to get on both your machines and, like... It'd be easier for you to, like, go to your subscriptions on both and just see which one's the Tier 3. And if you need to cancel, like, that one or swap it to the other one, or if you just want to go, like, to a Tier 1, which, you know, you don't even need to be sub, you don't have to. Uh, but you just end this. You could end the, the one that you don't need, right from your right from your uh, from your subs. But you'd have to go on both. Your I'm assuming it's once from your computer and once from your phone. <clears throat> Definitely not this one, unfortunately. So yeah, that is it. Cause yeah, um, like what I what I do is like when I go to mine. Um, I, I go to like my subscriptions and it also like it's, it gives you tabs it tells you like your subscriptions it's like gifted subscriptions and then expired subscriptions for well, like they expired for whatever reason whether you cancel them or whether you just let them lapse right if they were gifted to you they also fall in that category um, and then of course like obviously the current ones are like your username if you like, if if you have a Twitch account, you have a subscription to yourself, which is lifetime. It doesn't cost anything. Blah blah blah. But then anybody that you like, you pay to sub to, and then it shows you the tier. It's right there. You you literally can't miss it. Something on your mind? All right. So are we are we taking hey, things cool. here? You, you want this thing? What does he got here? Model. Oh, we could sell that. Inigo the Brave. The tail suitable for any gender, any race, at any time. Oh, I know what this is. <laughs> it's like the choose your own adventure. I'm assuming you're going to want that. Alright, so Requiem gets rid of the chest that's here. You, uh... You're gonna need clothes, aren't you? Everything else here should be... Yeah, it's all stealing, okay. Yeah, no worries, Mo. Yeah, like I said, it's um, it's one of those situations where... I, I can only... I can only do so much on my end, because... I just have a list of, like... People that follow, like... I'm sure there might be something for... For subs. Don't mind the naked blue, uh, Khajiit. Yeah, they don't seem to care. Oh, you want these arrows? Mr. Dragonfly says he would rather travel with me. Is that what he, he said? not personal. He and I go way back. Uh, okay. What are we trading? You want Mr. Dragonfly? I don't know if I should give him these. They do splody things. <laughs> we need to get him some clothes. And... I'm gonna let you hold on to the ebony. Because I'm not getting anything. And you can also hold on to the loot. Everything else we could sell. I think. We need, we need, we need to outfit you, which means we need, um, we need leathers. We should probably go to sleep. What time is it? 36 in the PM. So I still didn't activate Frostfall. I don't know if I'm gonna. It's, it's in here because... It's it's in here just because. We'll 
the light on. Yeah, the, what I was talking about was these benches. See the one where the, uh, what's your name, Let. I think these are handled by bits and bobs. But of course, it's it's not going to tell me because, uh, you know, no plug-in. I'm almost positive that's bits and bobs, but you can see how it doesn't really match the, uh, the Riften overhaul, which is kind of amazing because it's a bench in Riften, but it's used in, like, far, it's used in everything. I think it's, like, Noble Bench or something like that. It's just called Bench. But I really couldn't find... Yeah, that's because of the light. That's weird, isn't it? Yeah, that's the that's the blood. And a hydrate, thank you, Caladrin. I have my herbal tea here with me. They would be the first thing he would use, yeah. And I I have the like I said, I have the bow of shadows as sort of like a and oh shit, I'm not even favoriting it. But remember, we did pick this up. Weapon draw and cast invisibility, so. And I've got a couple of these arrows. These are going to be situational for me. They're all ebony tier as well, so. They do 90 plus, you know, fire, frost, and shock. Uh, triple damage to constructs. Thank god we don't have to deal with constructs yet. Taylor, another round. I think you've had plenty, Volwolf. Maybe you should head on home. Let us defrost here for a while. Stupid this list. is pleasant. Said, you want to frost here? Drinks. Yes, my friend. Uh, do you have any thoughts? I'm yourself. thinking this is a nice inn. You like the inn, okay. Okay. Okay, let us get back to it. Uh... What did you want to do? If you've got the coin, you're welcome here. Otherwise, hit the road. Uh, I've got the coin. Um... Yeah, we need a room. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. And I still... Uh, see, this is... I was writing stuff down yesterday, too, while we were going along. And I forgot to implement them, because, like, as soon as I was off the... Uh, off the, uh, the medical call, uh, I kind of had this all set up, ready to go, and I forgot to implement. I was going to add, um... Uh, ask innkeepers to show... I forget the name of the mod. I always use it, and I always forget to add it. Drink up, my boy. Drink to those who have fallen. May their souls find their way to Sovngarde. Take it easy, Father. You're making a scene. I'll rest easy when we've driven every last Imperial pig back across the Gerald Mountains. Now do me the honor. Wow, I those robes, they look father. freaking fantastic. Who are you, a dock worker? Up. Drink up. Yes, Father. All right. Yeah, it is dark. I like it though. It's just the right amount of the right amount of dark of that. With the shadows and everything. Let me know if there's anything else you need. Privacy. Thank you. So let's see, do we do this in the third? Oh, we got a wash basin in here. I don't remember this being here last time. What's that for? JK's, all right. We'll, we'll, we'll do third person, see if it works out. See if the blankets come over. Hey, Taylor, get off your lazy tail and take care no, of No, Taylor. Keep your scale. I hate that they send the, the barkeep, uh, no matter what in, when you try to go to bed. Like, that should be blocked off. That should be a mod that, like, disallows that. Because that's a pain in the ass. Mage Merlin. Welcome in. Just a general observation. Pollen season sucks. That is all. Yeah, we got rain here. It's gonna rain the whole week. You want a drink? Oh, you finally made your way up, huh? I don't know. It's on the menu. Depends. Are you thirsty? Hungry? Both? That's all he's got. He literally just has. Yeah, you don't have any food. If you'll excuse me, I have other things to attend to. <laughs> well, I mean, you're the one that came in here. Came in my room. We need to outfit you. 
So we gotta go. We gotta do some hunting. I am here for you. How many arrows do you have? I, I forgot to even look. Pooling our resources. Yeah, I just gave him. He's only got the 28 ebony. You know, we may have to. Uh, else, just ask. We're gonna have to get him some iron. And I'm gonna take those ebony off him because I think that's a little, a little much for him in the beginning. I'll keep them on me. See, you were standing there the whole time. Did you people sleep? <laughs> I said you people. Gaming Terry, welcome in. Welcome, welcome. We picked up Inigo. We talked to Sibby. I see, uh... Hey, can we use the poacher's axe? Oh, did I sell it? I sold it. And there's a steel sword. Do you want a steel sword? No matter the weather, Riften always smells lovely. I will bear your burdens gladly. I don't think he's got a sword. Uh, that's a quest item. Why is that a quest item? What's next? Deliver Harold's sword to him at Mistfell. All right. Well, now we need the woodcutter's axe. Hope you're off there by the time I get back. So I guess Harold's in the queue. Usually there's blue butterflies that float around here too. Is he? He's inside. No, he uh, he's got his bow, and he's got some ebony arrows that I gave him. He had a few on him. Yeah, it looks like Harold's upstairs, which I don't think we can get into. I think they they frown upon you. Uh, Yeah, and I think it's, well, it's locked. We can't break into add-up. I don't think I can use knock, right? Yeah, rank one doesn't work on that. So we're going to have to wait for him to wake up. You see these expert? Yeah. Other than, wow. That's, well, that's all stealing anyway. Oh, hold on. Take my advice. There is. Don't listen to that talk of the face sculptor down the Out of my way, Harold. The son of the Yarl has no time for idle conversation with travelers. Well, I have your sword, asshole. Took your sweet time getting it. I did, yes I did. Here you go, for your trouble. Garnet. Ten XP. Yeah, you seem to dislike visitors in Riften, huh? Every day, the threat of exile from Riften draws closer to myself and my family. Who knows how many spies the Empire has sent to our... Yeah, no, welcome in. We're at war. This isn't the time for hospitality. Thank goodness Mother is keeping a level head about everything. If my brother Sayerlund had his way, we'd be flying Imperial colors by now. Interesting. So he's siding with the storm of life. So you and your brother don't see eye to eye. Can you believe that fool had the audacity to speak of his love for the Empire in the plaza? He expects us to drop our defenses and greet them with open arms. To dialogue with them rather than defend our homeland by spilling their blood. He's a traitor, plain and simple. Had I been sitting on the throne, he'd be hanging from the gallows for his sympathies toward the Empire. Fair enough. Now if you'll excuse me. He gave me a whole garnet. It's really kind of it. Yeah, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to make Inigo some uh, some light armor. Buy some 
armor and live to tell about it. Interesting. I don't know him. Uh, let's go talk to the smith. Well, here, let's see if we can sell some of these things first. Here. Please, I need but a septum. Here, you're gonna have but a septum. Oh, thank you. Divines bless your kind heart. I guess. Yeah, kind heart. Uh. Can I interest you in some fine goods from Morrowind? Morrowind. See for yourself. Let's see what he's got. Yeah. Fine goods from Morrowind. Uh, do we want to spend 219? Natch leather. Uh, definitely take the cowhide. I mean, if we need it, we need it. You know, and I can make, uh, I can make potions to to get rid of some of them. You could have this model ship. We do not need. Keep your eyes to the road. All right. She's out here selling stuff. All right, let's make some leather. Cowhide. Cave bear pelt. Snow bear pelt. And I think we have enough leather strips. Yeah, we got 11 leather. So let's um. Let's use the forge here. Oh, I don't have any strips. Balaman. What brings you to Balaman today? I need leather strips. Purchase. The finest weapons and armor. Holy eyebrows, Batman. They say we get twelve. Put me a little under 3,000. And I'm gonna buy one leather because you never know. If you need any more smithing work. No, I think I'm good. So let's um let's put him in leather scout, huh? What's it, 150? Yeah, it's the best defense too. Oh, we've only got three leather. Can we even improve this? I don't think we can. I, my smithings are like six. Yeah, I can't do anything with this. Um, here. Mm -hmm. They're gonna like this. It's true. You give me best equipment, yes? I'm gonna give you some equipment. He looks good in this too. And yes, he's wearing the it hood. It is good to be enriched with you, my friend. Yeah, there we go. That even looks... He looks better in that than he looks in the Crimson Archer stuff. Looking to stay alive? I know that's going to sound bad. And I've, I've had him in the, the Crimson uh, stuff before. He looks fine. I'm sure a lot of people post it for He looks way better in this. Maybe because it's, it's his fur. I don't know. There's just something about this that says, yeah. That you look, you look like you're supposed to look. It's the cone of shame. I mean, hood. <laughs> well, I mean, he needs it. That's the downside. Requiem. Yeah, the leather scout. Yeah, he does, Terry, doesn't he? I didn't add it in though. Um, I, that's that's what I would. Well, for all my armors, I'm gonna have to make a patch for Requiem. Uh, let's go make some. Let's make our, some of our money back. We can go down to. Uh, oh, I think we saw the alchemy shop. Not the alchemy shop, but let's. I don't know. Let's check out here. I trust you're not planning any trouble. What can I do for you, friend? Um. I think we're in the wrong place, Inigo. Let's get out of here. 
Yeah, I know. Like normally he um he complains about wearing the hoods, but uh. We, we kind of let it go. Ah. Oh, it's empty. That's empty. That's the other thing I'm looking for. I'm looking for... Is she following you? Is she following me? You little symbol. I think she is. Excuse me. Uh, sorry. Just thinking about my experiments. Oh. So what, are you an alchemist? I'm aspiring to earn that title, yes. And it looks However, great. However, the road ahead is paved with loose cobbles and deadly pitfalls. Master Elgrim says I'm a natural, that I have a unique talent, but I fear his approval masks his intolerance for my mistakes. My errant formulas have cost Master Elgrim a fortune in ingredients, some of which are almost irreplaceable. Irreplaceable. So, what sort of ingredients do you need? To restore Master Elgrim's supply, I would need 20 Death Bell, 20 Nightshade, and 20 Nernroot. Death Bell, Nightshade, and Nernroot. Huh? You may be interested in gathering these rare ingredients for me. I could. Nernroot's going to be a little tricky, though. That means more time for my experiments and less time in the field. Much appreciated. Yeah, any clues where I could find some of these? Nernroot is the easiest. <laughs> oh, so you say. The water and makes a unique chiming noise. The only drawback is Apparently we already have one. Harvesting. Nightshade is native to the pine forest and marshy tundra regions of Skyrim. The and pine has forest, huh? Starburst like violet flower. Last we have Deathbell, which only Oh, we already have some nightshade for. All right. Its inverted bluish purple flower bunches are unmistakable. All right. Tell me about your family. <laughs> My family. Yeah, your family. All that wealth and they squander it on foolish ventures See the, and political They students. don't take the gloves into effect. I was meant for so much more than all of this. I, I don't really mind it. It's life. you know what it is. Normally when you're talking to them, they don't fold their arms mother like mother this. It's the animation me. mod that's I really messing it up. Alright. Why are you so fascinated by alchemy? It's exhilarating to I mean I am too, sort of on the body. You know, as a mage. I usually give him a lowered hood or an armored. Yeah. Uh, I mean, he'll wear the hood for now. We could give him an armored circlet in the future. Once I have enough money to actually, well, we're not going to do anything with crafting. I have to find one or buy one, and they are quite expensive. The eyes look fantastic. I, I really love it. The eyes. All the all the NPCs have. They're great. Well, we're going in here. Experiments can't be completed until you've brought me those ingredients. I, I hurry. will. Okay. Right. Well, I, I got business. So. Got a pretty full stock of potions and alchemy reagents. All right. Uh, we're just gonna use the lab here a little bit. Uh, let's see. Do we make? Do we make frenzy? Alchemy is not a spectator sport. Was it fly? It was fly, Amanita. And uh, is it elves here? No, that's fire. It's a class. I would like some more ebony arrows if they have any. Let's get our regens, right? Garlic and salt. We, we need more of that. I knew I had a lot of garlic. I don't have a lot of salt. And, yeah, we don't want to waste the nightshades. So. I need more expensive stuff. How about barter? Make two of them, and we'll use that before we sell them. Not need that.
Yeah, too bad I don't have any any more for invisibility. We have the Nur well, we can't spend the Nurn root. Uh, yeah, these are all weak. We're not going to get any money for these. Slaughter fish eggs. <laughs> All right, we're gonna have to make do with the little that we have here. I don't have the right ingredients. Needs more hanging moss. Needs more lavender. Needs more blue mountain flowers. You here for lessons, like Ingen? Lessons. Or did you wish to buy something? Uh, no, I'm here to trade. So, you're interested in my potions and ingredients. What I'm really interested in is your money. Uh, what else did we make that was kind of crap? We'll keep the regens like this. Um, we don't need the resist poisons, though. I can sell all that. Uh, stamina regen. Do we need eight of them? I don't think so. to keep that. I forgot to use my fortified bar. See, I always forget that. Always forget it. Alright. What about you? Do you have any... So if you had salt, that'd be... Yeah, we can... Here we go. It's perfect. I don't want to spend that much on that. Yes, yes, goodbye. Goodbye. Beautiful. So if I had the regular leveling system on, uh, we'd be you a way higher level. How busy I am. My mixture could be burning as we speak. Isn't that what your wife is for? Huh. She's in the next You're room. No Just get over to check on it. It's actually pretty good. What did I make? I made three of... It was stamina something, wasn't it? It says only two. We need the carry weight. Ah. That's fine. We need some restore yes, magic. Yeah, that's that's what I don't have a lot of. Oh, I do have because they're favorited. Maybe that's why the other one didn't pop up. Yeah, we got nine magic regeneration. Uh, let's do with the health regeneration. I think we're good. Come on in and go. Yeah, I thought it was, I thought I made three of them because I picked up three salts. Um, apparently that's not the case. So we have, we have just enough magic to, to cast that. Alright, we'll drop a little bit of a savey save. 
So, I, uh, you'll notice I don't have the, uh, like, this stone part. Uh, there's a fix for, um, for this. It raises it up, and it makes it look a little bit better. Uh, Ellie's Atrocious Rift Infix. Um, I believe it was initially by Eleonora, but it was taken over by Rudy and somebody else. And every version that I've tried, um, made it look really fucking bad. And her original version is... It's gone. I don't know. They must have yeeted off there a while ago. And I had a link. Like, look at that. See how it's, like, underneath? And it, it spans the whole way? Right? So, it was a fix. On top of that... Let's go to the back here. We'll go up towards the temple. Because... Yeah, there's places I haven't discovered yet. This this little back area here, right? Which actually looks pretty good. Um, that's the dead thief. What's he doing? He was running around before. Um, let's ignore. We'll ignore this guy for. Steel arrow. Take that. Interesting. Uh, it had a huge split, like right there, and so we obviously couldn't have that. Oh, jackpot! You're naked. He had a note on him. Where's the key? Read the thief's note. Thief's note. The fox told me he wore the cowl to forget himself and start a new life. Yet I'm the one who can't remember. Every time we meet, he's a stranger to me. Or was it a she? It doesn't matter. I spoke his words to a beggar, told her, Shadow hide you. She slipped me a note that confirms my suspicions. The gray fox is dead. And now that I've seen his headstone, I know for a fact his time is over. And the cowl will be passed on. I'm going to be the next one to wear it. And when I do, I'll become so rich, I won't need any memories. I'll just buy new ones. Huh. Okay. Saw nothing. Yeah. So anyway, we I I took her fix out. So so yeah. I don't know you. You'll still have you those, but looking for trouble. Uh, no, no, no. We're passing through. Yeah. Well, I got news for you. There's nothing to see here. Posture check. Last thing the Black Briars need is some stranger sticking their nose where it doesn't belong. Thank you, Caladran. You're probably gonna get a yawn. The Black Briars have rifted in their. Because I'm gonna stretch. Watching their back. As well. Keep your nose out of their business. Ugh. Me, oh, we know all about the Black Briars. Watch the streets for them. If you need dirt on anything. Yeah, you seem to be watching the front gate for them. Is what you seem to be doing. So that's how the scheme works. Bring you off. Well, we didn't actually talk to him about it yet. Although he did tell us that we sniffed out his little scheme at the front gate. And then this guy watches to see them come in. Then we're speaking the same language. Yeah, there we go. Good. So what do you want to know? Um, I'd like to know what this gem's worth. Do I look like a merchant to you? You look like a to take that up with a wooden post right now, Maul. Get in good with them, and you'll find her. I uh, I usually do clap. I welcome in. Silver, did I say hi to you? Or are you just popping in now? I feel bad.
I don't feel like I did. Let me give you a nice big ol' shout out. Uh, yeah, we killed Alduin in, um, Soulfruit's play. I don't think I got around to killing him in, um, in Norg's play, my Argonian. But yeah, usually most plays, we kill Alduin. The last time I did Requiem, Alduin was fucking real easy. Uh, the hard one was Mirak. Harkin was, he's just easy regardless. I don't know why. Yeah, I don't think we really need to know anymore. Be seeing you around. They always say to, you know, stay out of their business. Do we have any other business here in Riften? We're not, uh, aside from not meeting, you know, Brynjolf. Yeah, we want to find these things for Ask around the villages to discover Sveedy. Oh, we want to sell the stuff that he had, right? That beggar. Shot her. Yeah, we had some extra stuff. I think we could talk to to you. You've got nice shinies here. You gonna buy something or just here for Ah, she looks solid too. Otherwise, move on. Otherwise, move on, huh? Why well, you treat all your customers like that? Look, I've moved all over Skyrim selling these bits of junk. The eyes are fantastic. Scraping by. I'm not out to win friends, and I could What's care up, less if you're happy about your. Oh, you're welcome, Silver. Anytime, buddy. I just need the coin. You need the coin, the huh? I get out of Skyrim, the better. Trying to leave, huh? Yeah, you seem pretty desperate for coin. Why, you having trouble selling your goods? Are you serious? I've moved all over Skyrim selling these bits of junk, and I'm barely scraping by. I mean, it seems dangerous for a merchant to be traveling the roads with the war. Well, let's all raise a flagon to Ulfric. Future king of Skyrim and bringer of poverty to the working class. Interesting. I smell some hey, sarcasm there. You look there. like you could handle yourself. Maybe you can help me if you're looking for work. Uh. I mean, would you prefer coin instead? You just told me that you're having a hard time getting by. Are you kidding? I'm not giving her any money. Now, what did you need help with? <sighs> Seven hundred fifty. Yeah. Already. I need someone to pick up supplies from Narania, living in Windhelm. Uh, fine. Yeah, we can do that. Thank you. Just bring it back to me, and I'll gladly pay you for your trouble. Yeah, I'm not wasting money on her. So, what exactly am I getting? Don't ask any questions, alright? Just bring it back to me. Just bring it back to you, huh? Fair enough. Oh, we needed to sell things to you. You gonna stare all day or buy some armor? No, we need to... Everything I've got on display. <laughs> We're gonna really? take more of your wealth. <laughs> But she doesn't know. I gotta keep that. I gotta give that over to Inigo, I think. And then... Oh, we're really not getting anything for these, are we? He had some other stuff, too, didn't he? Yeah, like Glaze Bowl. Which we're not really getting anything for. A gold ingot. A silver ewer, which we don't need. And I had the feeling as soon as I sell this, I'm gonna need it. For, for something. Yeah, whatever. Do you have anything useful? Hauling. No. Not really. Just the stuff that I. Yeah. Come back when you're ready to spend more gold. What do you say, Inigo? Is he out there? We had to make you. Uh... He's still on there. This. Do you mind Working if I use that? Fishery is tough. I had to put some coin in my. I'm beginning to think leaving Mornhold was a mistake. I know someone else is using that. I'm, I'm gonna try to talk to him. What do you need? I need you there. There we go. <laughs> we need some. We need some firewood. We'll get a. Uh, we're gonna indigo some iron arrows, and then he'll switch to his sword eventually. Yeah, doing pretty good today, Karma. I just seriously need to get a shot of this cat. She's mesmerized by Grelka. Oh boy. Yo, Mega Black, what up? How's it going? I'm getting her supply of troll fat. She uses to keep that big stick up her ass, right? Ah! Alright, fine. 
Uh, Balaman. Come to see Balaman perform miracles with steel, eh? No, no, no. I need some iron. You have iron? Take a look. Actually, do you have steel? Ooh, that could be better. How much? 62 versus 30. Wow, it's double the price. So 372. All right. That's going to put me right around 4,000. If you need any more smithing work, come see me again. Bone mold, huh? Really? Oh, they're bolts. Uh, I, good thing I didn't almost make them. rack please Mr. Inigo you want to talk yes I will bear your burdens gladly good man give me the ebony you could have 181 steel and uh, hold my leather You could also hold my tent. Let us go. Are we good? We could have five this shit. Let's look on the map here. What else are we uh This is the fishery? Ah, Blackbriar Lodge. Do I have my hood on? Yes I do. You've never tried Inigo? Caladran. How dare you? <laughs> He's literally the best follower mod on Nexus. Hands down. My friend, Skyrim is a big and often You absolutely need place. to try him. We are bound to lose I'm not I'm not really giving you shit. I'm just Maybe I'm more surprised than anything else. That map you have is special. My map. Uh how's my map special? Let me show you. My brother once found Smoke this Joe, he is second and none. Hands down. Doing good. I'm also uh, doing a pure mage on my own. Probably my Please second favorite build behind Paladin. I love mages, Mega Black. Too. Watch this. Where are you, Inigo? That's the light reflecting there. off. If you thought he was blind in his right See? eye, he's not. Like That's I the light. myself on your map. If we find ourselves separated, all you need to do is look me up. Just look you up, huh? Pretty fantastic, eh? I think so, yeah. It's, uh, great. It smells like witchcraft. No, no, no. I mean, we're, we're a mage. We believe in witchcraft. <laughs> uh, any thoughts? Mine likes this place even more than I do. Wait, Strudel, you haven't tried him either? It feels almost blasphemous somehow. Wow. Yeah, he's he's definitely the best. He's the best of the okay, best. Let us get back to it. Hands down. Um I gotta, I'm going to let you in on a little something. I'm a little pissed at Joseph Russell. He did that modding tutorial for how to make custom followers, and then a bunch of people came out with custom followers, and a lot of them have fucking issues, and they never fix them because they don't know how. They just follow the tutorial. So I'm kind of mad. A little salty about that. We need the blues. Oh, there's so so many, so many blues. No, 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 no. No. Blue, blue, blue. Come back here, blue. Blue for me and blue for you. Eh. I almost feel bad picking the flowers. Right? You mod them. They look nice. Get over here. I don't feel bad about picking their wings. I'll pick your wings, too. Yeah, all set. We have to go to the Blackbriar Lodge? Which I think was this way. 
I heard wolves. Do we have my instincts on? I got him. <laughs> I thought one shot was gonna kill him. Yeah, we got a crispy critter. Take the pelt and the. Oh, where would the other one go? The other one went somewhere. That him? That's him. Yeah, instincts you gotta stand still for. Once you start moving, it dissipates it. I forgot about that. All right, fair enough. How close are we to a level? Yeah, we're a little over. Little Mr. Fox. Oh, come on. There we go. Leave it down here, yeah? There's another one. For research, for science. And what did she say? Inga needs. Ah, I hear one. She needs Nern Root. She needs Death Bell. Prospect mine. You don't usually use followers. I, I would assume out of anybody, Strudel, you'd be the one that would use followers the most. I never use followers. And yet here I am. Using a follower. Oh, the blue butterflies. Now we're in heaven. Ah, that's a weird camera shake. Where'd your buddy go? I saw him up there. Ah, there's another one. I don't feel like we're going the right way. Where's the lodge is over here? Yeah, we went the wrong way. Another wolf. All right, lodge is up there. Now I hear it. He's over here. Well, let's just go. We'll go up and around. So we'll get some healing going. I could probably use some of these these potions, right? Yeah, health regen, magic regen, uh, stamina regen. We're gonna have to make more of them. Let's use the runes. They don't look very friendly. Tumble down tower. They're banned. Well, they're not bothering me. Oh, 
and screw it. If I need one, I make it. Oh, you're welcome, Karma. I, I hung out, hi little fox, I hung out for, I want to say about an hour before, I, I went to lay down, and then I just, I passed out. There's woofies. Yeah, you come that way. Looks like Inigo got him. Well, got him the second time. There we go. I like these bridges better. They're more open down here. A deer that's walking itself backwards. Weird. Body. What are you doing? Seriously, what are you doing? <laughs> That's a requiem thing. If you guys have ever played it, you'll you'll understand. Nice. All right. I've uh, hired Tiny out in Beyond Reach, uh, but that's about all. I actually think the ones that are from interesting NPCs are, are usually good enough. It's actually worth a lot. Now, 500 is... Now, rephrase that. 500 is really not a lot. Because then by the time I go to do the exchange rate... Can I pick up that, that egg? Thank you. Septums. That's all we really need. Just their septums. I love it here. Oh, or Orcish Sword. Perfect. Here. You have a Steel Sword. That's a weird thing to ask me. Yeah, I can. Why? Well, it could be a good way for us to quickly communicate. Look, I found this book. It made interesting reading. Maybe you should give it a look over. Anyway, so I can what whistle you to you, huh? About? I got a better sword for you. What is yours is mine. Oh, you don't even have your sword. Oh, because I didn't give you a sword because that steel sword is uh was Harold's and I had to give it to him. Now oh, you have an orcish sword. And... Okay. And you're favoring the sword. Okay, let us get back to it. Looks good on you. All right. Oh, frost. Now we need to go meet up with, um, Oh no, we gotta get the the papers. His lineage papers. Alright, you go back and do horse things. Uh, I'm gonna save. Let me just re up my, my buffs here before we go back in. 
I don't want to be blowing things all over the place. You ready? We almost have a level. This is great. This is fantastic. Adapt. What was that? Nothing. Ow. Oh, there's another one. No. Are there more? Just the poultices, huh? Deed of Ownership, Horse, Frost, Stallion, Mealy Chestnut, Sire is Grain, Great Grandsire is Slepnir, Damn Unknown. I don't know what that stuff means, but I'm um, sure. It says stealing, but he gave me the key for that. Come on, you endless wonder. Give me your best. Please don't kill us forever. Did you work that out, Inigo? Huh. Well, we can't sell the stolen stuff. We're not part of the guild. Did you leave anybody else? Yeah, see, this all belongs to the... That's weird that her, um... Ah, oh, here she is. We really don't need another poultice, do we? Ah. Another gem. Legend of Crowley House. Do we have a level up? We do have a level up. That's beautiful. All right, let's figure this out. Let's level up. Where are we playing? We have 43 points to distribute. Um, let's get restoration to uh, 25, yeah? And then... I say, can we get alchemy to 25? I can only get it to 20, maybe. Yeah. All right, 25 for Lucius. So that looks better. Now they're now they're good. Um, we could really just save the points. There's no need. I can't do anything at these levels and I can only put two points because they're three apiece we'll get speechcraft to 25 there we save so all right that's good perfect um what are we gonna let's we'll start going back into magicka a little bit I think health is at 180 okay a single perk conjuration don't have anything for illusion yet. Alchemy, we've got the first two. And it's at 20, so we can't even take improved elixirs. Alright, that's fine. Speech, we're not doing yet. Resto is at 25, which means... I should be able to do Apprentice, right? Yeah. What's improved? That's 50. 
benefactors in so you've learned how to empower restoration spells now we're to overcharge all right so i have to take that first um we've already got improved mage armor magic resist is on the docket as well And I'll be honest, I probably just want to save the perk. Looks like a conjuration. So this is dual casting. And this makes them last longer. It's spiritual binding. Increases the strength of your summoned spirits. Extended binding. Ah, I think we hold on to it for right now. Because I could definitely use this later. Let's make a save. Sure to enjoy your lurk. Alright, now we can leave. Right? Was there nothing else that we... Everything else is stealing gonna do me any good yeah even from the strong box that he gave he gave me the key for it said stealing that's the guy with the uh, the battle staff okay uh, I guess we're stealing you again frost let's go find Louie Right up, yeah. Other side of yeah. Let's gonna say I feel like I have my light on. Instinct, yeah, he's right there. For the Oof. bad way to get down, isn't it? I think people forget that you can go into walk mode here as well. There he is. <sighs> Still a trush? Ha, you've done it! Got to admit, I wasn't sure you could pull it off, but you've definitely earned your pay. Yeah, a bunch of mercenaries in there. I, uh, I'm gonna be going to Maven unless I leave here with Frost. You're playing a dangerous game, my friend. Fine, you win. Take the horse and leave. Then we get the thousand septums. So now you're mine. We have a horse. Where are we headed? We can take the, we can take the custom destination off. Uh, I don't want to visit the fishery. Fellstar Farm in Iverstead. Let's go towards Iverstead. What do you think, Inigo? We, we officially have Frost, which I, I think is pretty cool. Now, also, let me get off here. I'm pretty sure, let's see if it works. I may not have set it up. That's simply knock, simple horses. Uh, mount control is H. Well, I just get on and off. Set own mounts is protected, yes. Player mount ignores combat, yes. Uh, unaggressive does not attack. Uh, yeah, we don't want the horse attacking. Um, we want them to be cautious. So if I hit H, 
So that's a whistle. Can I set that to F? I wonder if I have anything else on, on, on that. Let's see if F is another thing. F, well, F would be favorites, wouldn't it? No, favorites is Q. Toggle the POV. Uh, no, I want to cancel. We'll leave it on. Leave it on that. You'll leave it on H. I'm going to have to get used to it's on, it being on H. Alright, so Frost is going to follow. Very good. Very good. Let's make a save. Some Canis. Alright, let's go up this way. Uh oh. Somebody. Ah, oh, poor little fox. It wasn't you, Talzgar, was it? Ignorant minstrel and wandering wastrel at your service. Kasuni, welcome in. How's y'all Marion build so far? Going pretty good. Going pretty good. We're I think we just hit level 13. Um we're making our way to Iverstead to I forget what we're doing. Some may find oh, inspiration pick up something for Lan well, Landria. We're also making our way to Bleak Falls. Carousing in the cities, and I find it here in the vast expanses of Skyrim. We also have to figure out a living situation. I don't want to. All right. Then. I was gonna add convenient horses, right? But simplest horses is just—it's fine. I mean, you can make frost wait. Uh, I think if I if I make him wait there, right? If I hold H, it tells you if he's nearby. If I do it again, see now he's gonna follow. Yeah, it's just an easier easier mod. So much better than convenient horses. Oh yeah, you're the elk that I shot in the butt. Back here. So yeah, and then we're gonna we're gonna go to Bleak Falls. I don't feel bad. All those look at all the wolves over there. Nice. Should be Canis right in the middle here. I don't know if Requiem removes it. It's in the base game. If you ever come down by this broken tower here, there, there's, there it is. Look at that. Random Canis root right in the middle. It's the troll we killed. Wow. Oh, his hide's worth something. All right. Keep your eyes open. Don't you touch my horse. What time of day is it here? 30 in the PM. Let's go up this way. Let's see if we can sell off any of the stuff to the caravan. Kari? So many refuse to talk to us. They call us thieves and smugglers. And a welcome back. I am glad to see that you are not such a one. Let's see what you have. Take a look. So I'm thinking, what did I pick up? Just alchemy supplies, really. We got 30 wings, 76 hearts. We're going to need... We got lavender. I think we need wheat. We have we have a lot of wheat. We had a lot of hearts. I don't think we're gonna need any of the pelts. I've got a double person tent already. Okay. You good? Two ten. All right. 
Kari, do you have anything? Like a, like a... Ring of Replenishing. Oh, bam! That's what I was looking for. Uh, yeah, we want that. Thank you. May your road lead you to one sands. Absolutely. Another 120% regen. What are you doing, Frost? You, you messing up my parallax? Goods and wares of all kinds. And all can be yours. Alright. Can't go third person. Which way are we going? Well, all right, I guess we could go by the dock, right? Not you. You, you wait there. Frost, you, you can't come on the dock. I forgot about that. Oh, did I forget to implement the uh, little fix here? Yeah, you can walk right under that. Plank side. Talk to swims in deep water. It's an Argonian name. Is that you? That's Wujita. Please help me. I'm going to lose my job at the Riften Fishery. Went off for a walk with the dog. My job at the Riften Fishery is in danger. I, I would go oh, for a walk, no, except it's pouring rain outside. Actually, I couldn't go for a walk if I wanted to. I might I destroy my bag. To myself, but I can't help it. I tried some skooma I wish ago, I could. And ever since then, I can't stop. If you could give me a healing potion, I could cleanse this poison from my body. Oh, please tell me it's not cure disease. Life. Uh... I may have one. Your kindness will never be forgotten. Here, take this. It's all I can. I think she just takes a healing potion. Potion of restore. All right. So that's pretty. Uh. Bless you, friend. So where did you get your skooma? Look, I don't think I should say. I mean, they could kill me. I think you kind of owe me one. Okay, okay, I'll tell you. <laughs> I get my skooma from Sarthas Idrin. He has some sort of a setup over the Riften warehouse. You can't get inside, though. They've kept that place locked up tight since the war began. But who has the key? I overheard Boldy say that only the Jarl carries the key to the warehouse. When I meet Sarthas, I'm going to be taking more breaks, though. For me outside with um, we're at, like, an hour 40. I'll probably take one around two hours. As opposed to, like, waiting for three. So, what is skooma, actually? I'm not sure what it's made from, but I can tell you that once you've had a taste, you'll breaks are good, anything yes. else. The Dunmer came up with the stuff a long time ago. Very illegal and very hard to come by. I saw how many, um... I got my we we were over in Brandy's stream sandwich. the other day when she was playing Worst Skyrim. Um, and I'm looking at him like, you know, I, I really should be doing the exact same. Uh, for probably the same reason. Just to get up and stretch and not... But I get so, like, wrapped up in, like, what I'm doing, I, I forget about it. Like, I legit forget about it. Like, it's not even, like, in the back of my mind being like, no, you should really take a break at X time. If it wasn't for Skuma, I legit I'd forget. be on my way out of this horrible city. All my goals. That's what Skyrim does to you. Gone. Blame now Todd Howard. To start over. Another I'll thing to blame him for. Again. Although I suppose a little mead now and then would be harmless. Alright. So do you actually like working at the uh, fishery? Bully is a good man. He pays us well and watches out for us. All right. I used to work at the Blackbriar Meadery, but in Darren and I never saw eye to eye. That elf has no patience at all. Hydrate. Thank you, Caladrin. for the best anyway. 
I'm far better at fishing than working in a meadery. All right, so start this, huh? I enjoyed our talk. Report. We have a lot of things to do. We'll eventually do that. I'm not gonna do that now. Inside. What do you think, Inigo? We need to go to this Bleak Falls battle place to find the Dragonstone, eh? I hope it is not a horrible crypt full of zombies. You know about that, huh? Were you reading my journal? All right. You have any thoughts? I see you found Inigo the Brave. It's just a little thing I've been working on. It is probably rubbish. Hand it over, and if we're relaxing somewhere safe, I'll read it to you if you want. That's right, I forgot hey, to give him back his books. See what we have. Uh, Inigo the Brave and Inigo's Journal. You can have both of those. And I don't want you to be taking torch. I, I shouldn't even have any torches. What's next? Well, we want to go talk to. Uh, it sounds like an Argonian name. Inside here, can I take them? Salmon. Who's knocking baskets around? Ah. <laughs> I think it's this guy. Oh, we can. Eggs and skin. Oh, yes. It's not stealing. Oh, dude, if you have any more slaughter for that, would be great. Because they're good for alchemy, too. Oh, look at this. It's free salt, not stealing. River Betty. BC and Longfin. This card. Silverside Perch. Oh, yeah, all the good stuff. Look at that. Now, if only these salmon gave you the row. That would be nice, right? Mud Crab Kite. River Betty's good, too. Huh? Is that you? Do we need to be speaking to you? Swims in deep water. I actually like the fishing outfit. Uh, you work here. Can you teach me a few things about fishing? We like fishing. I do. This, we're a mage that enjoys fishing. Here, take a look at this. I'm I'm forcing it upon myself to 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 like fishing <laughs> for this character anyway. You help Ujita. She works there. Yep. That could be why. Yep. Usually locked up. Uh, an entire list of fish to catch, but I I literally just learned. Exactly. Trust me, Marsh friend. We're gonna have to get the uh, bound fishing pole too, so that way it'll save me uh, three carry weight. I bet they'll taste delicious. What? Why? <laughs> no, no. Who would ever want to harm such beauty? You don't want to eat them? I don't think there's a need for that. We like them. <laughs> They're my friends. Yes, you heard correctly. I'm sure you understand. I love this guy's dialogue. Alright, well, I'll do my best. Perfect. I will wait. Good journey, Marsh friend. We're a Marsh friend now. Yes? You have any other dialogue? Yeah, do you have any leads? Yes, actually. I have good work for you. Here, uh, how do you get the bound fishing pole? Uh, I think you can buy it from vendors, plus it's statically placed, Anna. All right, then. Uh, Reed Bounty, clearing out waterways. Fish up to four items from the water in Markarth. Interesting. Uh, by order of Jarl Igmund, some have taken to using the water that runs through Markarth as a place to dispose of empty bottles, worn boots, and other unwanted things. Not only is this unsightly, it poses a danger to our citizens. Sadly, we do not have the men to spare to clean up this mess. Yeah, because of the war. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, any who catch fish, at least... Who can fish up at least four... Wow, I read that wrong. Four pieces of trash from Markarth's waters shall be rewarded. Help us keep our city safe and clean for everyone. Okay. 
That's that's an eventual. That's an actual. Uh, rubbish retrieval. And catch of the day. Read the list of fair weather fish. I'm beginning to think that all of the Creation Club content is literally you reading. Uh, but is it from a mod? There is a bound fishing pole mod. Yes. Do I have it installed? Yes. It's literally called bound fishing pole. Actually, hold on. Let me, let me double check its name. I'm almost positive that's the name. Yep, Bound Fishing Pole by Grape Dog One. A uh, little bit of a well, I can't say older mod. Um, but yeah, it just just requires that you have the uh, Creation Club content. But here is. I'll even I'll even put it there. In case you guys were curious, I'll pin this for like unable to pin something went wrong. Unable to pin. Something went wrong. Please try again. Uh, Strudel, if you're here, can you pin that message? I think it's because I put the link first. Hold on, let me refresh real quick. That's not right. Alright, there it is. Yeah, I had to refresh. Alright, so I'll put it up for 30 minutes. Yeah, it's so it's a manual download only. Um, I guess the author didn't like the uh, maybe maybe they manually install mods. Just just drop it into your downloads folder uh, in MO2. I'm assuming Vortex is the same way because it's got a it's got a just like you would manually install any mod. Not uh, I'll be using JSurface mod and one that lets you fish anywhere makes it a lot better. Does Jay's... Hold on, let me check. Does Jay's have a bound fishing pole? I already have Jay's installed. I, I've already used it. Um, let me see if I can get the name here. Simple Fishing Overhaul. Uh, this is just animations, right? Fish in... Second person? Fish in first person. And in... And, New lines for the fishing quests and other fishing enhancements. Which requires OAR, which we have installed. Yeah, the features are right there. I have his in. I didn't get to read it, but... Yeah, but Jay's, Jay's mod is installed. So you can go into, uh, you know, third person when you're fishing. But the bound fishing pole should work with it as well. I don't see why it wouldn't. Uh, ours has dreamt of these waters many times, filled with strange, exotic fishes from all over Skyrim. No, not fishes, friends. Well, at least until they're harvested and sold as food. We have a business to maintain, after all. Friendships can only go so far before gold gets in the way. The fish in my dream seem to be okay with this arrangement, and he rarely lies to me. And so with his blessing out... I will teach you to catch these fish, and in exchange, you will bring them here. Here is a list to start with. Carp, glassfish, goldfish, and pogfish. They are fair weather fish and should be easy enough to catch. Even so, please read the first volume of Fishing Mastery, written by yours truly. The copy should be sitting on a shelf in the back room of the fishery. When you're done, return to me and we will find our new friends a home, and you some coins. Yo, bully. New in town, eh? Here for the fishing, I guess. <laughs> the understatement of the century. Uh, you can't have any of those. Are you a fisherman? Only the best in all of Riften. I own Riften Fishery. Started out with a single fishing pole, and now I have an entire building and two boats to my name. 
Not bad for a middle-aged Nord, eh? Too bad I haven't had the same success helping this city shed its poverty. And even Nor thinks I'm wasting my time trying. But I disagree. So who buys all your fish? I sell this my guy fish here. across a good portion of Skyrim. It's worth its waiting. Hey, he's listening. Hey, see him stop and listen? The only untapped market left is Markarth. However, I just got word that Klepper at the Silver Blood Inn might be interested. Markarth, huh? We, have to, we have to go that way anyway. I appreciate anyway. you delivering a purchase agreement for me. You'd be paid, of course. Purchase agreement to Klepper. Yeah, we could do that. We need money. Good. We need a house. Klepper we need, we need a place to... You the you know. Here you are. Does he sound quite charitable? We don't think we really care about his Remember charity business. Give, at the temple. give it the temple, huh? Uh, things to do. Repair holes and nets. Uh, it's just a honey-do list. What's this? Olaf and the dragon. Adonato, the Atelier. That's take, it's not stealing. Huh? Well, we're not collecting books. Fish out of water. Uh, Viria is an odd one. She wants to fill our precious waters with mud crabs. Mud crabs. Crabs are not fish. They do not swim. They do not smile. You cannot speak to a mud crab. They cannot hold a conversation in their knobbly little pinchers. They're clumsy creatures, but more importantly, they're unhappy creatures. Dour and sunless, like the soil in which they sleep. Ours is to wonder if Furia is not well to suggest such a thing. I take that. did say it was a ah fishing mastery volume one by swims in deep water how long no, it's not very long so you've decided to learn how to fish good for you it's a noble endeavor and with plenty of practice it could be a profitable one keep in mind that every journey begins with a single step one that is usually clumsy and will end with you falling on your face that is why, for your first lesson, it's recommended that you stick to calmer skies and fairer climates, where the fish will happily bite on even the most unattractive of hooks. This guidebook details four types of fish that are ideal for beginners. They're most, uh, they are most common on a clear day near streams and lakes in the fairer parts of Skyrim, away from snow and ice. Places one can catch these fish are much too numerous to mention here, but an excellent way to begin one's fishing journey is to start by casting your line right off the docks near the Riften fishery, fishery in Lake Honrick. Wow, long sentence, thank you. <gasps> Breath, breathe. Once you had your fill of lake fish, head west and try your hand at fishing from the river that runs alongside Iverstead. End your journey at the Vilmir Inn with aching arms and a full belly. We already have line and lure. And we'll read Horker's attack for the hell of it. Alright, I think we're good. Catches the day. What else do we have? Deliver the purchase agreement to Klepper. I think we have enough, Indigo. And we'll be something. we'll be back with uh We'll be back with more. It's nighttime now, isn't it? Yeah, eight forty in the PM. Yeah. That would be you, wouldn't it? The waiting, the insufferable the God's waiting. damned waiting. What's wrong? Listen, if you want to help, here, take a look. Don't ask, just take it. Maybe you can figure it out. So I know we're... Alright, yeah, in a pinch. We had a juvenile mud crab. Hey, get up my sword and bow to live a quieter life. I decided to study the lives and habitats of mud crabs here at the Riften Fishery. It's my hope that one day we might breed mud crabs, much like we do fish. If only everyone else at the fishery shared my interest. I'm in search of a juvenile mud crab, so that I may study its growth. These young mud crabs rarely leave the water, so now I need an intrepid fisherman to catch one. It can be caught in almost all lakes and streams throughout Skyrim, though a breeding ground is said to be in Whiterun west of uh, Broken Fang Cave, which is pretty far out there. Uh, and I know exactly where that is, but it's guaranteed to be. But they're, they're all over the place, so. Uh, please make haste 
I must show progress in my research as soon as possible. Viria Riften Fishery. Note to self. It's been 12 days since an adventurer took up this bounty, and so far, nothing. How much longer must I wait? A while. And we got Whistle for Inigo. Well, that's just awkward. He's not even holding it. <laughs> I wonder if it's because that guy's there. Let's try it again. Yeah. Could be the camera mod. Could be improved camera. We may need a patch between, uh... Oh, let's just stay like this. There we get salmon, huh? Yeah, we'll try it again. And a butterfly wing. I mean, I need proper mage boots. I have these brown boots that I've had since the beginning of the game. One of the fish he wants is wants was a carp. Which I don't have. Alright, in to go. Yeah, it would have popped up in my journal, right? Yeah, we don't have a carp. Let's get some sleep. It's too, uh... Now, there used to be... You know what? Is there one here? It's doing the same thing? No, maybe it's... Alright. Yeah, maybe it's because that guy was there. That looks better. Still... Yeah, in first person, too. Okay. Stick to third. It's a little less jarring. You lost your catch. Oh, damn it. Alright, in you go. Come on. We're gonna... It's the metery. The animations aren't great, but still better than locked in that weird window. Yeah! Oh, you were asking. Because if he does, there's one inside in a barrel. But that seems like cheating. That's like using console commands in a Skyrim game. How, how, how dare you? <laughs> we would never do that. Yes, we would. Actually... I'm going to save my money. We're not going to stay here. Let's go a little further along Got the road. The You've come to the right place. Yeah. Pull up a seat. No, we're going to... We're going to save our to money. And barb, my lord. Yeah, don't care. I can... <laughs> we, have a, we have a tent. <clears throat> we'll go along the road for a little bit. Stay in the bunkhouse? <laughs> oh, jeez. Helga took my innocence. There's nothing innocent about her. Alright, Frost, come on. There's Frost. Alright, we're gonna make our way to... Eh. 
Irish stud. This way, right? I want to go west. Go along the river. You know what I realized? I do have a dagger, just in case. I was thinking about getting like a short sword instead of the. Uh -oh. Spiders? Ah, oh, sounds like wolves. All right, I'm not getting off to chase them. Yeah, I'm thinking about a short sword. Now, remember, we don't have precision in this. I took out all the crappy animation mods. Uh, I thought I would like precision more than I did. It's, uh... I gotta be honest, it's kind of a shit mod. <laughs> it's not that good. Come on, Indigo, we don't need to get our brains split on the road. Oh yeah, hell no. Gonna go, you're on your own, buddy. Oh, and there's a nerner too. No, there's two bears. I know my limits. There's a guard over here. Guards are usually tough. You know what? We're just gonna go this way. We're gonna keep going west. We're gonna go west on this road. Oh boy. There's something in front of me. What is this? Oh, that's just that. No, no, no. Let's just stick to the road. We'll keep our dagger out just in case. I feel bad for poor Inigo, but I mean, hey. He's gotta keep up. Yeah, I think you can. I think you could stay there for free. Campsite. No, we don't want to be going in there. I hear the wolves. Oh, they killed a rabbit. I'm gonna let you live, you killed a rabbit. We're almost hybrid anyway, let me drop a weird save in the middle of combat that you should never do. Boy, they're going ham on the rabbits here. Ah, it's a troll. Ow! Dirt 
back. Alright, there's bandits everywhere. It's GTFO. We're not going to be able to take him out with our little dagger. I could use the Bowie Shadows for horseback. I don't feel like wasting those arrows. Oh my... Alright. Which way am I going? This way? Yeah, no thank you. I, I see a town. Yeah, you guys go that way. Definitely not a bear in that direction. Definitely not. Ooh. Poor Inigo. We're gonna have to whistle for him. <laughs> so yeah, the inn uh, with the other mod used to be up there. That's Klimek's house again. So the Villamere is where it's supposed to be. Alright, well, that's his problem. Inigo, that's a you problem. Let's go inside. Jeez. Yes, a spider. Oh, there he is. No, no more, no spiders. Just let me know. Let's take the level up, right? Oh, are we still in combat? Yeah, matter of time is on. Screw it. Uh, we have 47 points. Um, and now is where we start to put. All right, Alchemy's at 25. So it's between like 30, like 25 and 50, where they're gonna get spent, but you're not gonna see me spending points, because we need to get them to 50. So obviously, um, we'll start with destruction. One for alteration. That's that's great, Magus. Good job. Could have saved it. Um, and I have two points. Well, let's put this one into health. And we got two perks. Okay. So destruction's at thirty. I don't think we could do anything until fifty anyway. All right. The second rank of pyromancy's fifty. Cremation's not till 75. Right. Impact also 50. Adept also 50. Right? That's the downside. So if you're playing like the normal game, you can only train 5 per level anyway. So I kept it that way. Um, so we wouldn't, you know, I wouldn't be able to infinitely put points into. Um, destruction to get this up to 50 like ASAP. I think it'd be a little unfair. What's up, monkey? Welcome in. Once someone there likes you, Wujita once again to the rescue. Yes, she was. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, how about Resto? This is 50, but we can get an apprentice. We can also get, uh, oh, no, 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 hold on. Alchemy should be, yeah, 25. Notice this doesn't light up. I think this is an error with Requiem, specifically. Uh, because I'm running the uh, background that I uh, brought over. So it's it's my own. It's the one that gives you, and I know it works with Requiem. See the the bottle, the potion. I don't know if you noticed that. The sounds are different. I I hid the sounds folder because I like the uh, sound overhaul mod that I have installed. But each one has like its own, you know, unique little background. All right? Alteration is one of my favorites. There's the naked chick with the nice butt crack right there. I like that for enchanting. Smithing he, um, an anvil. Probably for a zenithar. Orcish armor for heavy. 
block as a shield. That's a cool one, too. Two-handed greatsword, and I believe a one-handed sword. Yeah. Marksman's a bow and a quiver. Some arrows. Evasion's, uh, looks like a light helmet. Sneak is the snake. Key for lockpicking. Uh, like a... What do you call those things? Kabuki mask for pickpocket. I'm not sure what the hell that is. And we're back to the potion. But yeah, I think we could take that. Improved is 25, right? Yeah, see how that opened up? It was blue. We could also take constant... Well, we're not going to do poisons. Uh, we want to get to... What's regeneration? Having altered your body... That's not till 50. Uh, slaughterfish eggs and sprig and sap. You're now able to regenerate your body. And do so even more rapidly when you're immersed in water. I don't think so. Well, we want to get to fortified muscle. This is 75. And then all you need is a mammoth heart and troll fat in your inventory. You become more resilient. But you need immunization first. We're not doing anything with poisons. We're not We're not a poisoner. Uh, in it go. We're still in combat. Let's make a save. If I were you, I need a room, Will. Away from the barrel on the east side of town. Welcome back, Strudel. And Soryuto, welcome in. Welcome, welcome. Uh, barrel? Tell me about the barrel. There ain't much more to tell. They're haunted. And you should stay away. Look, I see one of the spirits with my very own eyes. When it glared at me, I swear it burned right through my soul. So what, do the spirits haunt your town as well? Fortunately. They seem to be sticking to the barrel. Yeah, really happy with I the eyes. The eyes came out really good on these NPCs. Same with the skin. Who'd want to rent a room anywhere near a haunted barrel? What if I investigate? If you think there's anything you can do, be my guest. So what about anybody else? Has anybody explored the barrel yet? About a year or two ago. Some fella named Windelius came through. Said he was some kind of a treasure hunter. I warned him not to go in there. Just like I warned you. The very next night we heard screams from the barrow. And that was it. We never saw him again. Alright, I need a room. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Alright, good man. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. Still in combat, huh, with that spider that was outside? Alright, hopefully we go to sleep and um, Let it me lets me. If there's anything else you need. Why are you in my room? I guess, well, I guess it's not just my room. I hope I don't have to go outside and kill that thing. Lindley, would you mind taking care of the customer, please? No problem. Now we get a couple hours. I meant to turn that down. Switch it in engine fixes so it doesn't go by as quickly. Oh. Lindley Star Sun. Would you care to hear me play my lute? Um I play the lute. You play the lute. If you'd like to hear something, it only costs five gold. Uh, perhaps another time. Very well. A pleasant journey, my lord. Uh huh. Yo, he's just following me around everywhere. Is it absolutely necessary for you to bother me right now? Yeah, they all look good. No care you want a drink? What a boring conversation. Your real name is Speedy, isn't it? No, I'm sorry. 
You must have been mistaken. Is that Inigo hands. sitting on the chair I've picking me up? Did you see that? Before. Yeah, you've got nothing to fear for me. I promise. I'm sorry, I don't know what you're talking about. Interesting. How about you stop lying or I beat it out of you? Please, I beg you. Don't <laughs> tell Sibi what That's I am. That's terrible. He'll kill me. Sibi has been spreading lies about me. You must hear me out. All right, well, you tell me your side of the story. Sibi and I were to be married. We were supposed to be happy together forever. Right. Then I found that wretched poetry from Svana. When I confronted Sibi about it, he threatened to kill me. I was scared, so I told my brother Wolford. He went to talk to Sibi for me and... and Sibi killed him. My brother wasn't even armed. When I heard what Sibi did... That yeah, kind of sounds dead. like Sibi, doesn't it? And now you've found me, and you're going to tell him where I am. Just leave. Interesting. Well, we're not in combat anymore. The temple looks good. This is what's his name. Gray Wave. Karamine one. Well, I couldn't persuade her. I mean, we're not gonna kill. Oh, really? All right, that's a body slide issue. You must be one of those whispers from the college in Winterhold. Yeah, that's a body slide issue. Were they all like that, and I just missed them? I didn't notice the ones in Riften. Let's see. I, I doubt the men are like that. Yeah, it's a body slide issue. I'll have to fix that. All right. Other fishing spots, huh? All right, let's look around. Well, that's the first issue we've seen uh, in quite some time. Well, Landry is. Spoon, I think, right? It's at the farm. The farm is right here. Okay. Fellstar Farm. You lost? All of my storm cloaks were in an interesting state for a bit. Yeah? I think I remember that. That looks fantastic. Uh fast while well, you guys are Traveler, you must have so much to tell about the world outside this boring town. I wish I could go with you. You must be another pilgrim on the way up to High Hrothgar. No other reason to pass through here. Uh, High Hrothgar. No, I have leeks to sell, wheat, potatoes. No, what can you tell me about High Hrothgar? It's frightening living below their monastery. The Sometimes monastery? I swear I can hear strange noises rolling down from up there. That's definitely someplace like we're never going to go. There's never any rain. What do you make of that? I have no idea. Sure, leave. Everyone My else daughter's does. driving me crazy. So forgive me if I'm a bit on edge. Yeah, I don't, I don't care about any of this. as fast as you can. Nothing for anyone here. Have anything interesting to tell me? Let's get the hell out of their house. These people are creepy. What do you think, Inigo? You know Mr. Dragonfly? I am here for you. Any thoughts? No, my mind is a song without words right now. Alright, come on. Let's see if we can fix this now, because this is going to drive me nuts. Alright. Frost, you're, uh, you're a good Frost. Let's do this. All right, I'm gonna make a save somewhere near, yeah. All right. Okay. Let's see if we could solve this. What did I?
Simplest horses. All right, that's cool. All right. Where is my body slide output? I'm curious because I'm running CBBE. Don't we have a guard? We have a guards. Should be in the middle of here. Yeah, I took the frankly HD stuff off. It, it was, there was no point. This is glass. Guards and Stormcloak. But it's not being overwritten. I guess this is it's overwriting the Creation Club stuff. All right, let's let's go look at this again. We'll close all this. I hate I hate having these open. Let me collapse all these. Generated outputs. Body slide. Body slide has its own. So meshes, armor, and it's overriding everything too. So let's do this. Um, let's delete all these meshes. Actually, it's not. Let's do this in case I F this up. We're going to move you to my desktop. Sound good? It's a lot of files. Forearms missing under the army armor. Yep. Uh, just for the, just for the, uh, Riften guards. That's it. We'll delete the meshes there. F5 to revert that. Nothing's going to be there. And let's run body slide again. Let's see where I could have messed up. We're running, um, the Kirby preset. Settings go to my body slide output. Match build, I want it all, and so is it 3B, it's body amazing, right? So it's all going to be 3BA, this is right hands, the beast hands. And then, okay. I'm just going to go through the list really quick. Yeah, it's it's only for it's only for the Riften ones for some reason. I don't know why. And maybe it's something that uh, gets changed with Requiem. It's a possibility. They name it something different, and so then it can't find the right file path. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, but we want 3BA... And if there's no 3BA option, we want physics. Uh, Dark Brotherhood, 3BA. I think we want 3BA. And if they just have one or two, you choose the physics option. 3BA. Let's go a little quicker. All right, so there's glass, uh, vanilla. Yeah, so if, there's, if salves comes up as an option, there you go. Although, let me check. Meshes for 3BA. Requirements. Conversions will be redone and blah, 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 blah. Ancient Nord was redone. Because I also had an issue with Ancient Nord. I think this was why. Guards. So Stormcloaks and Sons of Talos. Nightingale, Capeless. Which I don't have, the Capeless. This is by Phantom Knowledge. This is a different thing. I wonder if I even need that in. I probably don't, do I? Let's cancel this.
Yeah, when I ran Body Slide, this Ancient Nord came up. And then for the slider sets, I don't know if I need this. And I have no idea what OSD and OSP mean. I'm sure somebody in, in, in chat knows. I wonder if I need this. Let's take it off. Um, body slide's fine, okay. Let's rerun it again. Thank you for the posture check, Caladran. Give me one second here. CBBE curvy outfit. What's the difference? They should all be on the same. They re it, the nice thing about uh, body slides is it remembers your, your outputs. So we want 3BA for everything, unless it says physics uh, for. Ancient Nord. That is... Okay. We'll stick with 3BA for everything. Hopefully that fixes it. I think I messed up somewhere. Yeah, and if it's one of these, just go with where you gotta like just look to see what it has. There, Stormcloak sleeves. See, it says sleeves physics. I think that's on the wrong body. That could have been it right there, the Stormcloak, because that came up as one. I'll just make sure we have 3BA for everything. And then some of this are like the, the, the jewelry. I've never had an exhaustive list like this. It's usually just a few things. This obviously just take the physics because there is no 3BA for that. And if you were using just regular CBBE, you'd want the CBBE with physics. So just make sure everything else is 3BA and I have it ticked. This is This is good. This is good. That's right, that's right. The nice thing about this, there's no plug-in. It's just meshes, that's all it is. So, Ulfric Armor Physics. Skimped. The Mask of Amalexia. I have no idea what that is. I don't know what's, I don't have anything skimped in here. This is all Creation Club stuff. Wow, that's an exhaustive list. Look at that. I'm going to assume they're all the same. Because I do have a 3BA for Creation Club stuff. Here we go. Dawn Guard. Yeah, we want 3BA for everything. Triple B's. And we're done. Okay. Let's see if we get that error on the no, uh, ancient Nord again. It errored out on me the first time I did it. Oh, all sets complete. Okay, cool. And then just F5 and body slide will populate again. There you go. So these are the new meshes, actors, character, assets, and then here's your armors. Here's everything. We just we just did it again. Okay, cool. Uh, I can collapse them all. I hate having them open. Don't like that either. Cool. Take two. I did say I was going to take a break, didn't I? All right, we're, we're two and a half hours. Let me load into the game. And then I'll take my break because I got to get something else to drink. My uh, my tea is done. I have like a s sip left. All 
I have the feeling it's not going to fix it, but I don't know. I'll have to, uh, I'll have to sort through it. All right. Anytime now, game. Come on. There we go. Let's just, we'll continue. It's easier just to hit continue with Requiem because it saves, saves are uh, profile specific. I've only got the one pro, well, I've got a modding profile on here, but I don't have any saves on it, so. What's up, Bixie? We're either going to be able to tell right away, I mean, yeah, put me in suspense. Give me the second loading screen game. Good job. Nope. Yeah, they're missing their arms. And the, the weird thing is, um, Iverstead Guard. Let's, let me take a print screen of that. Hold on. Because now I'm, now I'm curious. Before I do anything, keep the smashes here, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, so this is the this is the guard. Well, you can't see the guard because I've got Skyrim souls now. Let's leave that up. Uh, let's load everything up in SSC Edit. I'm curious. I don't think it's going to show me any conflicts, but you never know. That's going to drive me nuts now. The way to solve that is to just get rid of the body. Um, and then I'd be without, like, CVB. I could probably do that, because I don't have a body for the guys. I am running 3BA... For the women, but I don't know if something in Requiem is changing it, like changing the name, therefore it can't find the file path. But I've done this so many times, right? So what's her ID? Her ref is 23D. Uh, let's see. Yeah. There. S nothing. She's not not conflicting with anything. Iverstead location. Yeah. It's not like this where you you know, you could see you know, if I wanted to see the actual conflicts, that's the actual conflicts. Right? Rapid rock fall line, etc. from Skyrim to natural I mean some conflicts are are normal. Uh where's this chick at again? The one right above. Guard patrol number two. Yeah, it's not going to tell me anything. Wor you know, worst case scenario is remove the body mods. Just use CBBE instead of 3BA. Because that's not going to tell me anything. All right, let me see here. CBB's got its own. Yep. And 3BA has its own. And then there's the Creation Club thing for the add-ons. So body slide, let's see, female Argonian, female hands, feet, body. It's being overwritten by the output.
which we need it to be. The files have no conflicts. Wouldn't be in the creation club. I wonder if we put the guard... This is going to sound really weird. If we put the guard armor below the output, if it fixes it. Send that to the highest priority. Watch this. Let's try that. Oh yeah, the bodies don't have an issue. Um, it could be the outfit. I am also running all of Zav's outfits too. Not that I'm saying that that's the issue, but if it's just meshes and textures, and there's a there's a three BA add-on for it as well, which I disabled, but. Like I said, all those meshes that are in body sled right now, um, I have them saved to my desktop. I took the original ones out, so I could just swap these if we need to. I'm just trying this to see if this fixes it. The men don't need a body mod. I've, I've been pretty adamant about that for a long time. I think that any of the body mods that touch the guys look fucking stupid. And I never had an issue with uh, the UNP body, which I probably should have used, but I'm so used to using these two together without without issue. And if that's the only thing, I don't know, maybe I'll just I'll remove the the two bodies, worst case scenario, and then I'll just run the uh, script cleaner through it. Let's see if just placing the um, armor and uh, re armor replacers below the body slide output, output does anything. I wouldn't think it would, but you never know. My only issue with that is so many of the newer body and cool armor seem to forget there's a final. Yeah, right? I hate that. Yeah, see, it's not doing anything. So there's something, yeah, and they're all like this too. And now I'm curious. Because I'm going to revert all this stuff anyway, since none of this is the fix. And since it's technically not conflicting with anything, it's got to be a mesh issue. It's straight up a mesh issue. Female guard. Where's a female guard? You're not a female guard. I bet there's none here. Damn faithless Imperials. Yeah, how much you want to bet there's none here in, in the city? Where else would there be one? Shore Stone? You're not one. Are there any out in the docks, maybe? Be careful. Oh, you know where there'd be some? Up in the barracks. Or outside training. Alright, in the barracks. Yeah, it's gonna bug the crap out of me. See? No, she's fine. Welcome to Riften, home of the Thief's Guild. So they'd have you believe. It's all lies. They're just thugs, vermin, creeping around the rackway. So why are the? That's a dude. That's a dude. That's a dude. You're a dude. You also are a man. You're not. What Wake up. Uh huh? Put your put your uniform on. Come on, get out of bed. All right, see, look at her. Now she's... 
Now, why was the one downstairs? Hold on a second. There's another one. How dare she, you. She's not going to have arms either. So it's the Riften. But why was this one downstairs? All right. How come you have arms out of all the ones what here? Dragons? <laughs> You're the only one that has arms. She's got different armor on. This one here? Uh, not touched by anything. Base Skyrim. You know, I'm curious now. Let's do this. Let's quit out again. Let's redo body slot here. I'm gonna I'm gonna reopen up all my mods. Um, let's expand all. Let's go to guard. Stormcloak retexture. All right, this is at 11.79. Let me put it back in place. We're gonna we're gonna experiment. Um. Let's go put you in your right cat here. Move, send to, separator, NPC, overhauls, no, no, no. Uh, armor's weapon and clothing. Which, believe it or not, makes it actually a little bit easier. I think it's at the bottom. All right, so let's just put this back where it sort of was. Right. Okay. Let's not. Let's look on Nexus. I want to see its mod page. Uh, Zab's meshes for three BA. That was the other thing, right? Let's put that back on because we're gonna wind up redoing body slide. This is at eight forty three. All right. This body slide can delete. We're, we're going to get rid of you. We have the original one anyway. Um, I'm going to reread this real quick. Guard's armor. You know what I think it is? Because Requiem changes the guard's armor, and I don't know if I changed the mesh. Right, so what was it, 873 did I say? No, eight something. All right, 843. I knew there was a three. Let's reinstall it. Guards armor, guard shields, stormcloak officer, and the creation club. I want to see if there's any other options. We want the tech, do we want the mesh? Replaces the guards armor chest meshes with my own version, adding sleeves and reducing the gut belly on the mail set. Meshes are based on vanilla. If you're able to make patches for CBBE Himbo 3BA, please feel free to post it. Now, I took the textures only. I'm going to take the mesh replacer this time. I just wanted the textures. We'll do the same thing with them. And... We don't have any of these, but I do have the open face guard helmet. Let's reinstall and replace. Sorry, it became... What's up, Big Eos? Welcome in. Get the mesh? Well, I'm having an issue. Maybe you can help me out. Um, the female guards, all except for literally one female guard uh, in Riften that are part of the Stormcloak faction, are missing their... Like... They have their forearms, but they're missing from, like, their elbow to the shoulder. They're the only ones. I'm running CBBE and 3BA. And that should be everything. Let's see. Minimize this. We're running the curvy. Let's just go curvy without the outfit again. Because that's initially what I had it, right? Settings are going to go to the output folder, which is fine. Let's make sure we select everything. And I don't have anything for the men, so. But they're the only ones. All the other guards were fine. For females, you need compatible body slide. All the other females are good, though. It's literally just the Riften ones. Every other female I've seen in the game has been has been fine. 
they've all, they all have their proper, um, well, the only thing that glitches out too is I've got some like idols and animations that like, so like when they cross their arms, you can kind of tell that it's, it's not meant to do that, but. So all my settings should be saved from the last time. So let's just, let's generate it and see. Maybe just remove the mesh from the rift and body slide up, but could be. Yeah, because I've got Zabs in there, and I have literally all the all the ones. And But I'm playing Requiem. And, you know, Requiem changes the guard's armor itself, but it doesn't... Let me see. Let me just F5 so that gets put out. Beautiful. Let's load up and see. And then I got the original meshes folder here. I could always throw this back into body slide. I, I took it out and saved it to the desktop. This was the issue. This was, it was, well, the guard's not there, but you can see Iris said guard. And then there's the ref ID that I was, I was working off of. So let's see if this, um, if this does anything for me. Here I am an hour later, I was going to take a break. <laughs> We're at the three hour mark right now. Um, there is a, I'll be checking the loose files being overwritten in MO2. Yeah, I've got the, the one for Zabs. Yep, I do. Although I wonder if that's in the wrong place now. Does that need to go below the body slide output or does that just need to go above body slide but below all of theirs? Because if that's the case, I'll just put it right above body slide output right there. You need the Zav specific one. Yeah, that's the one that I have. It's not made by Zav though. I just said the author's name and now I and now I forget who it was. On the plus side, the nice thing about this is no plugins, so And I, I'm not gonna make I'm not gonna make a save or anything like that. There's no point. I think it's just uh Caliente's tools, you gotta build bodies with it. The load order wouldn't matter. Uh, what matters is when you run bike slide itself on that menu, it pops up and choose the right option. Yeah. Just call me Tanner. There we go. Mesh has fixed it. So choosing the texture only option fucks it up. The mesh. There we go. Note to write down for myself when this becomes a Wabajack setup. That's that's still the goal. How you doing, Frost? There it is. So choosing the mesh. All right, hold on. Let me write this down. Actually, it doesn't even matter if I pull console up because it's we, Skyrim Souls. <laughs> All right. Um, choose. Mesh replacer in Zabs. Okay. Yeah, uh, Biggie, this is this is the one I've been working on for like four years, and it 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 didn't always look like like this. Um, we're we're under 1,100 mods, so it's you know it's it's not a big list, but it's not a small list either. It's you know, it's it's a good size. Let's just say that <laughs> it means two things. It's a good size. Uh, for me, it's a smaller list, but it's got a lot of stuff, and it's got expandability. So it's made right now for Requiem, but you can literally swap Requiem out if you don't want to play it, and you could probably swap it for Eni Rim. Uh, you could swap it for Simon Rim. Um, I haven't tried it, but I'll, I'll probably test it, and it, I know it's going to need patches. Like, if you wanted to do Skyrim Redone... I know, I think that was that was actually reported by JD Smith. It's Tendo's, Tendo's original Ellie mod. I, and I'm kind of like looking at that and I'm sort of hoping that somebody does the same thing with Perkis. Because I liked Perkis better, but uh, Skyrim Redone has way more modules to it. Um, and then of course when I do the other ones I'd, I'd have to go into like patch and say like activate this patch. But as it stands now it's set up for Requiem.
and we haven't had a crash. We did we did an eight hours. Eight, uh, sorry, we did an eight and a half hour stream yesterday. No crashes whatsoever. Uh, I think there was one issue that we fixed yesterday, so I've got that sorted out. And then this one today was like the first real uh, issue I've seen, and uh, you were able to actually fix it pretty quickly. You like Skyrim more? Yeah, there was no. See, that's the thing. Yeah, most of my my list my list never crash. That's that's like the major thing with me, like personally. Um, the NPCs they're never gonna look as good as like people that go all custom. I've got two major NPC replacers, and really good quality male and female skins. I've got 4K for the Argonian and Khajiit. I took out high poly head because uh, it was causing an issue, and then Anna told me about the eyebrow fix to make it not like shiny so we added that in Oop, we're rotating stop rotating uh, what else do we do and wind welcome on in see so sneak and everybody's got green <laughs> welcome wind There's a high poly head synthesis patcher. I I know of it, yeah. I didn't want to add it in. High poly, for me, whatever reason, it just gives me issues. I like I like it. When I had certain setups, I use it all the time, and I was gonna use it for this. Uh and then I didn't. But like no crazy third person animations, like It's not a it's not a Souls setup. Like Skyrim was made to be a first person game, and I like first person animations better anyway. Cause I I if I'm being honest, I built this for me. And I know people are gonna ask like, how come you don't have the Souls style or the stances? Cause I don't fucking like them. I gotta be completely honest. I think they're shit and they don't belong in the game. Uh, so they're not gonna be on my setup. And where was I trying to go? But we did. Pa the paper map, obviously. Uh, which, you know, the map could change. If people like the other map. I know a lot of people like this paper map. I did all the world spaces for that. What else did we did? Uh, your high poly issue is staring at you. I love hate high poly head. Yeah, same here, monkey. I don't like building a face without it. Inigo causes problems with high poly head. To fix it, you just gotta let high poly overwrite Inigo. Which I did anyway, because uh, Inigo is right at the top of the NPCs. So the way that I do it is, um, so for this, I've got interesting NPCs. Um, yes, I do. Inigo, thank you. I've got uh, the extra NPCs for the college. I forget the name of it. Um, it's just a pretty simple install, and they've got their default faces, but then I've got... Um, files to overwrite it. Like, you're, no, you're never going to see a dark face in my game. I've taken care of everybody. I ran the dark face issue reporter. There's no face gen in this. Uh, unless it's lying to me. Uh, but I've, I've touched every NPC in the game. With, with essentially two mods. And then, of course, little add-ons like the hair, the, the skin textures, the eyes. Um, there's a... What's it called? Well, the overlays are obviously separate, but I've got two separate ones of those. I've got presets in here, so they're like, what, the J, J slot? Files you can just add and remove. Uh, those are those are compliments of uh, Miggy, because I like Miggy's presets. Like, this character is based off of one of Miggy's Altmers, and I, I changed some stuff about him. Yeah, we're going over to... Yeah, we're going over to Bleak Falls now, I think. How does it feel up there? How does it feel up there? Spine chills, welcome in. How do you like this mod? Which are you talking about Requiem? Oh, I gotta fix the uh, the main on Frost, huh? Or is that a lighting issue? I bet it's a lighting issue. That is, let me see. 
Yeah, it's to the east. It's morning time, isn't it? Yeah, it's 8 in the morning. How much you want to bet that that resolves itself? Oh, there's a bear. You want to deal with this? Alright, I'll... You probably could. That's the, that's the bear that's across. Oh, he's right there. Why, why are you right there? Ah, it's a waste of a heart. Oh, can we get him? Yeah, we got him. Bass. That looks odd. Is it starting to snow? Is that what that is? All right, Frost. You gonna follow me? Just follow me. Let's go by foot. I love Requiem. Frost is a crappy drugstore die job. <laughs> nah, that's that's definitely that's the lighting. Cause look at the sun's popping up, and I'm sure we could fix that. What's what's Frost from? Is he, he's not from Critic Kitty, is he? ZZ. All right, so ZZ's horse overhaul is handling that. You could swap that out for your favorite horse overhaul. It doesn't it doesn't really make much of a difference. That makes a huge difference. That absolutely makes a huge difference. Ah. Yeah, we need more of that. Wow, look how bright that is. That may be something in E and B. Let me check. I'll have to play around with the EMB. Could be because of the snow. I don't have anything else in for snow, so it's just whatever whatever Nat three is doing to the weather is what it's doing. Although the it looks it looks good like when you're when you're just walking, but when you look straight ahead of you. I don't know, but it looks really nice on the trees. So it could be Northern Roads. Maybe, I don't know, Northern Roads and that needs a patch. It looks a little too white, right? Make sure the Wisp Mother's not here. Oh, wonderful. Can we... Can we take her out? She's gonna, she's gonna appear. This isn't gonna be good. We have no, like, frost resist. Alright, well they're gone. actually does it pretty good. Look at that.
Eh. I can live with that. It's probably because it's so bright. I'm sure there's a way to, to tone that down a little bit. Can we break this? This should be Adept. I can't break Adept, can I? Uh, it's expert. Yeah, we need knock. Uh, we need greater knock. The water looks way more like urine than I would be comfortable with. I mean, it is Iverstead after all. Did we get him? Crispy Critter. Yeah, it's definitely bright. But that's kind of cool too, because it's like, it's snowing. I guess it's got that effect. Look at that. Yeah, that's a lighting issue. But now there's snow on the trees. All right. That's kind of cool. Who needs seasons when you got this? I would be running seasons on this setup if it weren't for that um, issue in Falkreath with the with the um, the rock. The what? There's like one rock model that changes during the snowy. And it's the only thing that stumped me. And I don't do stuff with like models and textures at all. Wow, the logic fantastic. But... Think we could hit that bandit? I can't tell. They're there somewhere. And that's other things too. Like if you see, look at look at the top where like the bandit. I could probably move it down under where it says "Freight is 22nd of last year." I could probably move it down just a, like a, like a cunt hair, tiny little bit. <laughs> Hey, snowberries. We haven't seen any of them yet. I don't think. Get it! Evil rabbit! No! Not the wolf! Alright, now the wolf. He took my kill. Bad dog. This looks nice. There's there's dummy. You're dead. See you later. Get off my bridge. Sky above, pee below. It's the Greybeard's piss runoff. <laughs> Always boil the water before you drink it. Yes. Watch out where the huskies go. You don't eat the yellow snow. <laughs> so, where we're at here, um, is it, uh, not halters, Karen. What's the one that's right over here? See, I don't have the regular map. I can't show you. It's the one where Goldeer is. Big Log Bridge. Yeah, you know, I don't want to go into first person. That, we, need, we need arrows for him. Alright, we're picking up arrows for Inigo. He's got some steelies. 
And I've got the backup ebony. Well, we've got about 30 backup ebony for him. Workish bow, isn't there? Yeah. No, I think this is expert now, too. No, this is novice. Nice. Uh oh. I saw a rabbit. This almost doesn't even feel like Skyrim. Uh, knock. I don't know why we're picking up lock picks. I, I don't I don't pick locks. You ready, Frost? We may as well ride here. This looks pretty good. Horse butt. Yeah, I was gonna stay on foot just because of uh, ingredients, but oh, this is really pretty. What's the name of this place? Somebody's probably gonna say it in the, in the uh, Hilgren's Tomb. Could never remember that. You leave that fox alone, goat. All right, Mr. Fox, be on your way. Yeah, it's making the water, like, transparent. Yeah, cause see, it looks like the fish are just kind of, kind of there. I'm running water for E and B, so I bet that's a weather issue. But it's it's fine over there where the where the the rapids are. You got Rally's water foam. That looks normal over there. Right here. I don't know. <laughs> Transparency issue. Strudel said it. Oh, we already went to uh, Redoran's. Strudel, did you figure out the body? Yes. Uh, I just, I reinstalled um, Zav's guard and Stormcloak. Uh, and I chose the uh, additional meshes. I Initially, I was just running the textures because I didn't know, I didn't know what the meshes actually changed. So then when I ran body slide, it, uh, we're going to have to get off uh, Frost, aren't we? Frost, you're gonna have to wait for me here. I don't want you. Uh, I don't want you getting in the way. Okay, you wait there. Wow, this is this is gorgeous. Get in to go in on the shot on on him too. Yeah, you can look up too, buddy. We have to. Uh, yeah, we gotta take these uh, these bandits on too. Last stamina regen. Let's get a rune. Oh, they're coming already. I don't want to get hit with another one of them. Indigo's going in there. Uh, probably should restore my health too. Ah shit, he's down. Oh wow, look at them all on the bridge. Alright. Ah. 
That's Elsie. Oh shit, we're out of magic. Fuck, 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 fuck. Yeah, I see you there. I thought about it. Yeah, you're on fire. Magic. The spiker. Oh, nice, he's got a flame club. Shit. Too many fire things. But we got most of them. Gotta save. Go get him. We got that asshole. Oh, he's got a crossbow. And he's dead. Is he dead? He's dead. You're frozen. Frozen in place. I love that. Ah. Got the one up here. He came down. All right, in you go. I hear more. Oh, he's right there. Ah, uh, that seemed to freeze you. <laughs> nice. There we go. I'll be taking even more of your septums, thank you. Nice of you to show up. Come on. What I miss in chat while I was doing battle there. So... Yeah, the body slide files needed the meshes for the armor, and he just had the textures. Yeah, well, see, the weird thing is, is it gives you meshes. It just doesn't give you the alternate meshes, if that makes any sense. Is it the same satchel? This guy, yeah, we didn't freeze him. He, uh... Oh, wow. We don't need the book. Did he, s he did, he slid down. Lizard, huh? Two bottles of water, nice. 
Yeah, he was the he was the crossed one. When I get hit with one of them, and I'm I'm effed. We're we're done, man. Game over. Like I said, I forgot to remove animated clutter. Oh, they do look good. Look at the... Oh, now I forget which mod's handling that. It's going to drive me nuts. They look really good. I'm actually taking it. Oh. Let's, uh... Do a big old TM. I'm taking a screenshot of that for for the servers. There. Sound good? Alright, let's get our heal on a little bit. Heal over time. I do have the ward. I've actually, I've actually been using it. Uh, it's useful. Words in this are useful. Bandits never wash. I can usually spell them a mile away. Ooh. Illusion robes. And a scale cloak. Should we put? We should put the illusion one on. This is just basic ones. May as well. They look good. I like that. They don't stray too far. They look... They look really good. Oh, I wish you had a higher resolution. This is the highest resolution on there. This is the main file. Uh, Inigo, you have to carry some stuff, buddy. I got some arrows for you. You want to talk? Uh, let's see, what did I miss here? So Strudel's attempted to do a little bit of housework, but I'm now just not doing well today. Dizzy, oh, damn, Strudel. Drink some water, lay down. Don't feel, if you need to, if you need to go, don't ever feel like you need to be here. If you're not feeling well. Uh, Vinswap put out a YouTube video on his updated policies and ways to protect him and those that use his music just out today. Uh, good to know, Gaming Terry. Do you, uh, I'm sure I'll see it because I'm sub to them. Or him, if it's just a one. I thought it was a few. Am I a game designer? No. I wish, but thank you, Bugging Out. No, I, I'm, I'm far from... I don't make games. I just I mod Skyrim, and on a good day, I uh, I'm happy with my output. <laughs> today's a today's a fairly good day. You want to hold on to that bow too? Yeah. Oh, so I can take some some extra stuff. Imperial bow of chills. I, I took a bow just to get a bow. Oh. Oh man, we're, oh, we are gonna get on so many fucking adventures. Dude, let's go tag team some Yo, bitches. meet me. Eh? You, wanna, you wanna go tag? You don't want to? Okay, let's go explore Appreciate some the shit. This is the next best thing. Welcome into the shadows. Let's go get Frost. Yeah, we had to take out, what's her name? Elsie? Yay! There's Brook Bass. Which we don't need. We do need Lavender. Yeah, see how the snow stopped and now it's... looking normal? 
All right, Frost, come on. I love that look. I kind of wish they were the destruction ones, but I get why Illusion is the blue. Blue's my favorite color. I would go with this in a heartbeat, but uh, we're not using Illusion yet. All right, any other? I think there's some bandits down here, right? Crispy critters. Yeah, we turned them into crispy critters. Literally, crispy critters. <laughs> I don't know why I'm picking up the lockpicks. Can I? Can I? It's that one. All right, Frost, you ready? Yeah, guys, like I said, so far, I've been super happy with this. A few, like, a few issues we found. Did we search her? I think we did. Let's find out. I think I did. I, I made sure to search her, because sometimes her body... Yeah, Elsie the Spiker. She's got a dark headscarf. Let's take her... <laughs> her charred body. If we're going to if we're going to white run, I may as well sell some of these. We need the money, right? We'll take some of the heavy stuff, like all of it. I'm not going to pick every bandit. All right, let's go frost. F five. That's what I forgot to do. I forgot to take my break. So we're gonna do that right now. Let me let me uh let me pull up OBS real quick, guys. I'm gonna take my break. I keep forgetting to do this. And wind needs to go mute. That is okay. Uh, give me five minutes or so. I'm gonna grab a different drink. My tea is now cold. Does not taste good. And uh, I'll have my phone on though if you feel like chatting. I'll be back in about five minutes. See you in a bit.
Good. I did save, right? I did now. All right. Well, we have a horse. We may as well ride it. <clears throat> Welcome back, guys. Thank you, Terry. You mean like get out of the chair? <laughs> Uh, maybe. Yeah, you know what? Um, no, because I'm super encumbered, and what sucks is now there's all this lavender here that I need. We'll come back this way. It's it's not a it's not a super priority right now. Um, other things. I did away with stupid edits. Stuff that um, other guides use that. Here we go again. Uh, you want to get that skeever? Go get him. Oh, he's gonna run away from you in a go. Go chase him down. Oh, come on! Just use your sword. He's right there. <laughs> yeah. Um, I figure it like this. I'm already running the anniversary edition of this game. There's gonna be, oh, edits. Uh, so we're fine with that. Tell me I ran into lot and I had the lot add-on for the trees. Yeah, I definitely do. I definitely added it. West River. No, we don't have to go to Riverwood, do we, for anything? No, there's nothing there. Oh, except for Bleak Falls. Alright, yeah, we gotta... We'll do that later. <clears throat> Is that the courier? You did see the guy running across that area right there, right? No, I guess he's going up to the farmhouse. Leave him alone. <laughs> um, and I hate to I hate to be that guy. All the Rin mods, but I'm gonna be that guy because they all have issues. I know I know Lexi and the team are hung up on them. I don't care for them. I've pointed out issues, more issues with that series of mods than I think anybody, and. They haven't patched for them. You would think that would be something that would be done. And the OMA also hasn't fixed them. It's like I'm lying, but I can give you pictures with ref IDs and and screenshots galore. I think it's a, it's a pride thing getting in the way, or a lack of time. I don't know which. I'm trying not to place blame, but it's been like over a year. So I got rid of them. I eated them out. I said, fuck that. I said I'm not uh, I'm not putting them in some of them look really good some of them uh, don't look very good at all that's my take and there's other things too like I probably could have added in like the serenity overhaul for silent moon's camp uh, just a choice on my end not to you know I, I don't need a lot. I've got some stuff going on in the tundra. Ugh, we're walking, I know. It sucks. Uh, Adrian. How you doing? Good to see you. Good to see you too. 
Uh, what do you ever sell? Finest weapons in armor. I bet I have more than you. Oh no, you've got some elven stuff too. Do you have an elven short sword? Is that better than what did we give to him? An orcish? We gave him an or yeah, so that was sixty. Wow, quicksilver. I need a uh you know what I need? I need a silver. Like a silver dagger or a silver short sword. She doesn't have one. Yeah, we're not buying any of that. Um, you wanna buy some stuff? Uh Could have made some more steel arrows for Inigo. Right, can we break this down? Can we break this down for steel? Good luck out there. Am I still cucumbered? Yes I am. Damn it. How about now? Is that cat's eye you are carrying a lucky charm or something? You don't like the cat's eye? <laughs> oh, we can! Alright. We're gonna need uh we're gonna need more firewood for you, Inigo. We're gonna have to go borrow uh No, we have a woodcutter's axe. Remind me to leave this here for what's his nuts. This guy. Oh, we already left him one. All right, well I'm keeping it. Uh, Sigurd. Are you a sorcerer from the college? Yes. Yes, I am. Hey, get off there. I work for Bellathor at the General Goods Store. I know you do. We've spoken of this before. I need you to get off that wood chopping block. Thank you. Oh God damn it! Fine. Use this one. Use this one. Come on, get up there. <laughs> when he's being a jerk, you just come over here. Ah, Sigurd. The true hero of Skyrim. Need more trees. I need more trees, Vixie? I could have added Alpine Forest. Um, but I decided to keep the tundra looking like a tundra as opposed to a pine forest. Although a variation of trees I could have, although I've got like six different tree mods wrapped together. So technically, like Nature of the Wildlands alone is like three gig. My tree, my tree mods about 5.4? Cause I have it all wrapped up. Like, um, we have blubbos as well, right? For for here. But this has its own pl plugin, right? But it goes really well. Like I said, I don't have any city overhauls. I don't use them. Uh, I find them tacky. I find them cluttering. And I would rather just add flora and you know make make the uh, the textures look better and the models look better and, and fix things and. You know, use Sky King signs. Yep. Now we're a fatty. How's this drunken huntsman look? See? Everything looks like it matches. To me, anyway. Well, aside from Skyrim 2020, this. This is, for whatever reason, this whole road, and, and only Skyrim 2020 shows up here. That I don't like. I'd like to, I'd like to just, just fix this and not have it be part of a larger mesh. Um, what are we making here? Steel arrows. We could, we can make four. Uh, right. I hope I didn't make bolts by accident. How would you feel about some more this arrows? This is very pretty. But it is not as delightfully damp as Riften. I like trees and white run. Fire in the wrong place could do a lot what's the other what's the one? I know Sky King uses the one, but it's got like a shit ton of dirty edits. And unless he's patched it himself, if he goes in his game and he looks up by like the bannered mare, because I know he uses JK Skyrim, there are trees literally poking out of uh the additions that JK makes. It's it's a dirty mod. I know he's known this for a while. It's got to be fixed up, but it's an old mod. And who who am I to tell somebody else how to how to mod their game? 
I tried it in mine because I used to use it on console way back in the day. Yeah, I have another 120 for you. How many does he have? 267, huh? And you've got an orcish sword. All right. And a high grade bow. Karn. Hi. Let us go. Uh, let me let me show you kind of where. So JK's adds things around this area, right? So we're talking up here, right? But that tree mod that he runs, and I can't think of the name of it. Is it Trees in White Run? Oh, I, I want to say it's something else. Although it sounds familiar. It's a tree mod for White Run that's got both those things in the name. So maybe that's it. But there's trees like poking all out here. They're poking through the market stall. And you can see them from a distance. It's not like you have to be right up close to see them. They're poking out from like over here. But, but it looks really nice. Whereas my trees are a little toned down. But they're all over the place. Like, Whiterun looks good. In fact, I think it looks better. I spent a shitload of time making it look look this good. But, like, yeah, he's got, like, taller trees here. But they need patches for JKs. They need, they need patches for Dawn of Sky. Actually, any uh, Whiterun overhaul, that particular tree mod needs a patch for. It needs a fix. Back up here, like if you go back, I mean, maybe this one has it too. Let's see if Blubbo's has it. Now Blubbo's trees are kind of out there, but yeah. So Autumn of White Run. If somebody said that in the chat, that's the name of it. Autumn of White Run. That's the one he uses. So I think I don't know. I don't know the one you're you're running, uh, Vixie. I'm a tree person, so I moved out to Arizona where we don't have large trees. That's it. Paradise City for White Run. Wait, wait, and includes trees. There you go. Yeah, he uses, he uses Autumn of White Run. That's the one I tested, and that's the one that we had on console, and that's the one that's dirty AF. And it's... I'm sorry, but if it's, like, sticking through market stalls... And... Sky King can patch that, it would take like all of a second. And I remember watching, because I was, I lurk in his streams all the time, even if I'm not saying stuff. Um, I, I really enjoy watching him work, but I'm like, I face palming. I'm like, dude, you're like a god tier texture modder. Fix this. I know you know how to fix it. You, you built city mods and town mods. Maybe he's changed it, I don't know. What else do we have to sell? Let's go talk to to dippy here Welcome we have trees it's not the General. super tall deep green like I'm used to from the East Coast yeah see we have those here since I'm uh, I'm East Coast <laughs> everything technically mid-Atlantic I guess if, if I had a sister I'd sell her in a second uh, some may call this oh he wants me to sell the skooma I call them treasures yeah, like, we don't need the the bear pelts. Or the wolf pelts. We don't need the firewood. What else can I get rid of to you? Scale cloak? I might hold that. Um, that we could break down. Did I pick up anything? Bottles of water we need. We need a home, guys. I'm, I'm using my stuff, and I don't have... I could store some of this stuff on Indigo, but he can't carry all this. And... It's a combination of my money having weight. I don't have any arrows. Well, I do. But I've got a quiver, which I can't sell to him. You'll see in a second. Uh, what do you have for sale? Bellatone. Some may call this junk. Yeah. Maybe I call them treasure. What I'm looking for is a necklace. You don't have one. Although you've got this. Of course, I don't want to spend this. What house do we get? You see, he still has bounce. We sold him bouncer. Look at that. He's selling it for almost five grand. What do we get for it? 120? Can Frost carry those things? Um, I don't have it 
in my game that he can, no. I think Convenient Horses allows you to do that. Does it? It's been a while. Uh, I typically don't use horses, guys. So I put Simplest Horses in there just for the hell of it. So you can, you can use the MCM. He's even got the Poacher's Axe. See, we got rid of this. You know what? Here, hold on. You take this Woodcutter's Axe. No, we're going to need this, aren't we? We're not getting anything for these, are we? Nope. No, no, no. Oh, I've got beef stew. And it's favorited. That's probably why. Yeah, all my favorited stuff he can't touch. So I don't accidentally sell it. Yeah, we got nine beef stews. There, we're at 285. Some yummy beef stew. Please do look around. I'm sure I have something you'll want. Maybe. Uh, it does. Convenient horses. Yep. I thought simplest horses does too. Uh, let's go check that out. Uh oh. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed knew to deliver. It. Your hands only. Let's see here. Ah, a letter from the Yarl. Moving up in the world, eh? Looks like that's it. Got to go. A letter oh, from the Jarl. So so what does Jarl say? That's not the letter from him. Sid Gear. We've all read this a thousand times. I'm not going to read it. The purchase agreement from Bully. I do want to read this. Will I get XP for this? No. Uh, the agreement certifies that Klepper, owner of the Silver Blood Inn within the city of Markarth, will pay Bully owner of the Rifted Fishery within the city of Rifton. Sum of three septums per bushel of fish. Payment is expected upon delivery, and profit is guaranteed to be fresh. Boy. Okay. The power of whistling. I think we've read all our stuff. Let's go try that. I forgot I had the beef stews. Move it up in the world, eh? Oh wait, it's just sleaze gear. That's how we refer to him. Of course, he does side with the Empire, and uh, we are Thalmor. Well, I guess sort of ex-Thalmor. Let's let's try this now. Let me check the MCM, which I don't think it has anything. Confidence, aggression, right. Is there something I need to do to you, Frost? To get you to carry stuff. No, that's get on and get off. That's a little jarring. So aim at the horse and put the hotkeys. That's H. Ah! There you go, Anna. Thank you. Ah, there we go. Alright, what do we put on you? Torches. Rolls of paper. See, yeah, quiver. That's 11 right there. Um, we really don't need the bow. Or any of these arrows. Or, well, I'll keep my fishing rod on me just because. Um, you can have that. You can have that. I need that. That doesn't weigh a lot. What do we have a lot of here? Should have sold in the scoom. I didn't even think about it. And all of my... Ingredients. Some I haven't even eaten yet. Sorry, Ingen. We'll have to come back to the horse to, to get your stuff later. Hey, look at all that weight off. See, I told you it's all the alchemy stuff. Look at that. We're at 80.
We're down to 68. And my coin purse weighs like almost, like, it weighs 10. Which I don't want to put my money on him. But that's fine, we're down to 68. Anna, you're, you're a savior. <laughs> Combined effort with Gaming Terry and Smokeless Joe. Did Smokeless Joe, oh, because you guys are all the same color too now, what the hell? I think the default key is H. Yes. Thank you, Smokeless. Simplest horses does. Should be on a hockey. See, I, I need a second monitor. I need that second monitor. The best part of owning a horse. Yeah, putting stuff uh, on him. We don't need that bow now. Hey, this is the way it's supposed to look. Let me do it. I can't, uh, I can't go into free cam here. I can't, free cam doesn't let me do it. For some reason with this mod, it puts me way above wherever I'm at, which is not normal. <laughs> All right. Come on, Frost. You're now useful to me. Watch out for fire. Um, on a, uh, a plus note, guys, I got a message from Stone Spiral Gaming early this morning. So I'm running uh, Quick Light with their alternate meshes. Like I said, it's, it's my favorite lighting mod. And I know I mentioned it, how Elderberry works off the uh, particle light system. So, um, Shane mentioned he was going to look into it for this one. And I said, you're awesome, thank you. And I probably gave him a hug through the phone. Not through, well, I was reading it on my phone, so. Through the monitor, the little screen. Let's go this way. been a while. Oh yeah, that's right. I have edits here. Don't come on horseback. Guard. Let's go the other way up. So that would be awesome. Yeah. Uh, he, he was always cool. I was... I always liked Shane. A dead saber. That's not us. But I'm happy to know that because this is like a lot of people's favorite... Uh, lantern mod. So the the nice thing about the alternate meshes is that you get to choose what lantern you have. You just need static mesh, which everybody uses. If you're not running SMIM, go mod on PlayStation, right? Uh, and you need the quick light mod. And it's a, it you know, it's the default key to L, but you could change it to like the SMIM lantern to Nordic. This is old and dusty. There's a Dwemer lantern. Which, when used with base object swapper, would give you, like, whatever combination you like. Uh, there's a Dwemer. And I want to say there's, a, like, a sixth one, and I can't remember which one it is. There's another one in there. There's, a, there's like, six six or seven to choose from. And then they all, they all work the same way. But this is by far my favorite. Old and Dusty. Uh, for me. And it works pretty good with every single character. Wow, two pelts. Um, where's Frost? Oh, were you hiding in with the snow over there? No, I don't want you to wait. We're gonna go on foot. We're gonna we're gonna save as well. I think we gotta go more towards the giant camp, right? That's where the, the clearing is. Now it's starting to snow off the mountain, isn't it?
Did I change the setting for my snow? Because my snow did not look like this yesterday. I wasn't even playing around with it. Hold on. Maybe I did by accident. I know I wasn't playing with my innies. It didn't look like this yesterday. It looked like the white grainy... Hmm. That's something else I'm going to have to look into. I don't know, just turning the set... Yeah, it's turning it on and off doesn't do anything. I haven't changed my innies settings. Alright. We're, we're going to go with this as it sits now. Bulbous and Maik. Yeah, definitely didn't look like this yesterday. Let's check over here. Ooh, big kitty. Oh. We got him. We singed it, but he knocked me over. Bad kitty. The medieval lantern version. What's up, Quattro Carl? Welcome in. Makes you think of Marl. I must acquire a beast of burden. I can't. I can't. I can't lisp it like Stu does. <laughs> Let's check the snows over here. Yeah, dude, what the F? I legit did a test run through here yesterday. Last night. We've got the complex pearl. I didn't even move it. Anyway, alright. Mr. Giant, we're going to come over here. Don't, we're not going to bother you. Let's do this. Let's make a save. Let's check out Dawnstar. If Dawnstar is like that too, then I've got something else going on. I went through all my snow to make sure... Think we're threatening with our old war. We're not soldiers anymore. Yeah, see, this looks better. Yeah. Yeah, it looks better. What time of day is this? 7 in the PMs? So, why is White Run snow. Let me turn my light off, too. Yeah, look at this. This is perfect. This is the way it's supposed to look. Let me turn my light back on. See? This is the complex parallax. So, white run. And I got, you know... We got footprints going on, too. I, I was doing all of my testing up here for the snow. Because um, this part here had some issues. Yeah, this looks normal. Look at that. And the moonlight, too. Let's see the little. Alright, so it's just that area by White Run. Don't know. I don't know how the snow in one area could be look different than another. Could be the weather. It very well could be the weather. Snow is snow. It's the same <clears throat> everywhere in the game. Yeah, look at that. Look, it gets noticeable. It's like instantly noticeable. Uh, sorry, Mr. Giant. We're we're going up the mountain. Yeah, leave me alone. We're going up the mountain. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna we're gonna ignore it. Let's see if I turn my light off. I wonder if it's the light. Honestly, I wonder if it is the light. Hold on. 
Yeah, it's the hold on, it's not me, it's the light. Uh oh. The lights the lantern's causing it. Cause if this was normal Yeah. Alright. Good to know. So it's the lantern. So I'm not I'm not officially crazy. Who's got a murder boner for me? Somebody up there? Look at this. We've got 100 regen there. We got 120 there. It's probably a that's just a regular wolf. Come on, dummy. Come get me. Ah, oh, come this way. Good job, Inigo. That's an ice ice wolf. He would have hurt. So it's not the snow, it is it is the light, in fact. Now, I'm really curious if I were to swap to Elderberry, if the particle light does the same effect. That I don't know, I've never tried it. That is a nice view. Yeah, this looks fine. Okay. Just don't have your lantern. I could probably use candlelight. Because the roads are fine. Ah, the roads aren't fine. Yeah, it's definitely the lantern. It's doing the same thing. The roads are all, uh... Ah, jeez, what are they? Assets from northern roads, I think. Dirt paths. Try with the torch. Good idea. Do I still have... I think I gave it to the horse, didn't I? All right, Frost, I'm going to have to try with the torch. Taking it one torch from you. Oh, Indigo's got it. All right, well, that solves that. Could be Ian. Well, no, I have Ian be laid on the... Well, let me turn this off. Oh no, my glow is from... Alright. Maybe it is just a lighting issue, so it's not... Alright, it's not the lantern mod, because it's doing it with the torches. I didn't give you a torch, dummy. Uh, maybe it's just one of those things that, with parallax, you just kind of have to deal with. I don't know. Frost, you ate there. During the daylight, in natural lighting, it it looks so good. I don't know. And I don't want to change it. Look at that. Why do you have that? Are you okay? Okay, let's do this quickly. Oh, you're giving me away. And quietly. Give me that. Right behind you. <laughs> Who's gonna get hurt? And he goes down. That's wonderful. Down already, buddy, huh? You got that one? Good job. I think there's more.
Nope, wasn't expecting that. Good job, Enigo. I am not feeling at my best. It is a good thing I heal quickly. It is a good thing you heal quickly. Yeah, see, the snow up here is fine. It's literally just the parallax snow. Uh huh. All right. You give me best equipment, yes? It didn't do a lot of change anything. Uh, it doesn't seem to, because I tested it both before and after I ran it, uh, Terry, so... I think it's okay. I'm also sort of taking a guess on that one. But I, I did test it before and after, and it was, uh... Yeah, it was solid. That is the darndest thing. That oh, looks good in here. Look at this. Oh, jeez. Thanks, Inigo. I do not like the smell of this place. Let us just find that dragon stone and get out of here. You want to move from her so I can. Why can't I, uh. turn her into, uh. Oh! <laughs> there you go. I got some more septums. Yeah, he looks he looks fine like that. I don't even think we need cloaks. Like I said, I have frostball installed. Um I don't really feel like I'm going to activate it, honestly. I could. I mean, it would make it a little bit better. I, do, I don't even have a needs mod in here. Of course, you know, we could run survival mode. I don't like it. But let's, let's take the level up here. All right, 47 points. Get that to 40. Um, get that to 35. Now I have two. Okay. Um, health is actually pretty good. 240, huh? Should we put any in a stand? Now let's go magic. Right? Or should we go health? Let's go with one more for health. That'll even it out at 250, huh? Yeah, these are all 50. These are all skill of 50. I can't literally not do anything else. Um, alchemy's fine for now. About restoration, huh? Should we? Should we not? You're able to overcharge their effects. What's focused mind? You've learned to, you can keep your concentration even in stressful situations and regenerate your magicka faster. The studies of the healing magic now grant you the power of making yourself almost invulnerable for a short duration once a day. Your understanding of healing and how magic and life are intertwined allows you to call upon your newfound power more often. Wards. Improved healing. 
heal wounds much more efficiently. We need stuff like this. I need like a good healing. Let's, so let's take Apprentice. And turn. We want heal self. Rank 2. Yeah, I'm going to go right for rank 2. Uh, we don't need protection from poison. Do I go Arcane Ward 2? We may as well. I don't need to turn the undead. Or do I? I don't think that'd work. Let's let's go with the ward rank too. Alright. Healing yeah, maybe we could heal Inigo, I guess. I don't know, what do you guys think? Should I go for the second rank of the ward or should I go for healing hands? What do we think? I've already got heal self rank two, so We'll swap that over to, instead of, what do we have for five? We've got Healing Aura on self. That's the long, the long-lasting uh, heal, but it doesn't really seem like it does all that much. Like, I'm going to get one shot, or I'm not. You know, I'll keep that on the favorites. I just won't assign it a hockey. So he can hold his own, huh? This is, tr yeah, he does heal pretty quick. Let's go with the uh, the ward. We'll go with four. Finish. And this allows you to empower them. So yeah, like the aura, right? Let's see how long this lasts now. Wow, it takes up a lot. Does it last any longer? Twenty minutes. It's still like what's that? Twelve hundred seconds? I guess it doesn't really matter. Yeah, see how it's gradually healing me? Now it actually looks like it's working. How much is that? 31 per second? And we do have Sunfire. Uh, let's go to our spells here. Firebolt is on 2. Mage Armor Rank 2 is on 3. The Skeletal Warlock on 4. Let's put Soul Trap on 4. I'm not going to be summoning him. 5 is going to be... Heal self. We'll swap that over from healing aura. Right? Let's see. Oh, yeah, that's. How much does it heal? 31? Yeah, that's gonna be enough for me. Um. The word is what? 7, right? See how quickly it, uh, for like triple the coverage, it's, uh, it's not bad. So if I want to keep that up, and then we'll just use, um, magic regen, health regen. I don't have a stamina regen, but we're fine. I did search you, didn't I? Yes, you have a high shield. All right, cool. F5, let's go. We're geared up. Oh, and let me do this. I forget about it. I know I have the uh, hood on it. I think it's eight. I'm gonna take that off. Let's um, let's put Sunfire on eight. I'm curious to see how much more damage this does than a fire spell. We'll we'll test this out. Do they all have bone meal? Do we need bone meal? So that's. Oh, that's a lot. Oh, yeah, that's like double the... Firebolt, or fire, or fire, what's it? Firebolt is 54. Sunfire, wow, 78. Okay, so that's why. This should wreck them. Well, we've got, uh, we got... Got this guy here. No, nobody here.
Who needs who needs magic when you have Inigo, right? I have the patch and everything for him. <laughs> you want to talk? No, I need you to get out of the way. So I can turn levers. At least uh from my experience with Inigo, usually my followers fall pre pretty quickly in battle. Uh but he'll be good even when I put him in Yeah, I always put him in light. I know he can use both. Requiem's a little bit different though. How it how it handles things. He'll he'll occasionally go down Oh. Yeah, I wanted to, I wanted to uh soul trap. How far away does this go? Oh good, it's still a projectile. Thank god. We'll eventually... I don't know, should we do enchanting? We're gonna have robes. I think all my stuff's gonna be enchanted already. Um, let's go with the rune. I don't know if we need land wraps. Okay, what is that? Out of enough. See, he went right down. Maybe that's the poison. How long does this last for? For 95 seconds. Okay. Part of its soul can be captured in a gem of an appropriate size. How many gems do we have? Oh, I only had the one. All right, well, screw that. <laughs> I could have sworn I had more. You, you, yeah, you're apprentice too, huh? Yeah, now we got a common. Let's see, can we, can we fit him in a common? Go get him, in a go. Wow, fire mages are no joke. Like, I know I'm still a glass cannon and all that, but... Damn. Plus, you know, the undead and all that. Help me. Help. Alright, I'll help you. Give me a second. Help me out of here. I'm looking through the sacks. Scaled? Silver die katana. Uh Get me out of here. Why can't it be a one-handed weapon? You over here. Get me out of here. You did it. You killed it. Now cut me down before anything else shows Yuki. up. Yuki. What's going on? Where's the claw? Yes, the claw. I know how it works. The claw, the markings, the door, the hall of storage. I don't have a web mod. I don't have webs installed. You won't believe the power the Nords have hidden. See, I keep seeing things and I'm like... Now, I know that's not vanilla. I know another mod is handling it. But I usually run... I think it's by Ramcoid. Because I know I've got Ramcoid's Aurora. And I've got something else but I don't have his webs mod Sweet or their webs mod I can't I don't know him. all right cut you down huh oh did that not do it will this do it let me see that doesn't work, huh? Coming loose. I can feel it. This sword is shot. You moron. Why should I share the treasure with anyone? Survival is not 
Arvel the not so swift. Do we need the bone meal? I don't know. So let's let's do a, a little test here. Since I know there's a whole slew of them here, let's get that guy. Now let's try a firebolt. Does firebolt work better? Of course, we do have the extra perk. That's not gonna work. I guess it doesn't really matter. They're all just gonna have bone meal, aren't they? Well, I'm a hoarder if nothing else. Yeah, so, alright, three of those. Watch out. It's like the same. Actually, fire seems like it's better. Honestly, fire is better. The rune, huh? We could use the rune. Sorry, Inigo. You got too close. Haha. <laughs> We already have ice, don't we? We'll take it. Spooky in here. So if you're wondering what it looks like really without the light on, there you go. If you guys if you guys can see it, I made sure to choose the uh, particle lights for the for the candles in here as well. I think it looks a whole hell of a lot better, of course, you know. Lantern's on so y'all can see. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Three of them and... Yeah, fire's, fire's just fucking better. I don't know what else to say. Can he go? He's gonna run in there, isn't he? Sorry, in go. Oh, he's mad at me. Well, dude, he's going to kill me, isn't he? He's legit mad at me. 
That's the red dot. That's him. I can't talk to him. <laughs> I've never seen that happen before. Alright, come here. You good now? Come on, get up. Now he's not mad at me. You gotta reset your AI each time. You're gonna have to be careful with those runes, dummy. We're like, I, I'm, I'm probably gonna have to be careful with the runes. Good job, Magus. Piss your teammate off. I'm not picking up any more of that shit. Try healing him? Uh, I can't. Don't have anything to heal him with. I didn't take healing hands, I took, uh... The ward. And that's for the, uh, the drugger that shout. Ooh. Let's see the ambience in here now. Oh wow, this is properly dark. I don't know, you guys probably can't even see this right now. Let me turn my light lantern back on. It is, it looks good. Wow. These look solid too. Glowing mushrooms. Watch this, ready? This is CC's caves. I always run this mod. I added the parallax effect to it. It looks so good. There, so you guys can see again. Really? Are all these locked? They're all going to be locked, aren't they? Get him. He's still mad at me. He's still mad at me or what? Already on weapon, my friend. There is killing to be done. Ah Not me, ah. dummy. Meet me me the dummy. Um Thanks, Inigo. What was I saying? Something about him being the best follower ever? I mean, I can't I can't really argue with him. He was pissed that I, you know, put that rune there. But to be fair, he's the one that kind of walked into it. Um, first death of the day. Courtesy of not my enemies, but my followers. This is why I don't use followers. Oh god. How far back are we? Did I take the level up yet? I think I just did, didn't I? Yeah, we already took our spells too. Okay. I've never seen Inigo do that even all the times I have hit him. He did that happen to me last month. Yep. Yeah, Requiem. And uh, you can't put them into a follower framework, which is why I don't have a follower framework in this. I would add nethers. But um, I knew for this particular play I wasn't, uh, I was, wasn't going to need it. I get to do all that again. Uh, you know what? Since he got the kill... Hold on, let me make sure this is right. Since he got the kill on this guy the first time, I'm gonna try and get it this time.
Yeah, it's weird, and there's like no. Yeah, Requiem really changes everything. Look at that. I hope this is worth it. Bad kitty. Oh, I still go through that animation even with my hands out. Okay, that was weird. Uh, Although, I wonder if him walking through my fire... Well, I guess it doesn't do it as well, does it? That answers that question. I was gonna say, I've got frozen electrocuted combustion. combustion and, uh... I wonder if him physically going through that hurts him too. To the point where he gets pissed. Yeah, he's paralyzed. <laughs> That's hysterical. So let's uh, let's hope this guy doesn't give me a Daikatana. Let's hope he gives me a regular one. No, he gave me another Daikatana. Get me out of here. That sucks. I was hoping for a, a one-handed. save here this time. Oh, he's an idiot. He's not mad yet. Good. I probably should have taken healing hands. Now I feel bad. Oh well. You good? Yeah, he's, he's just sitting there. not coming. He's still down. And I can't talk to him. I may not be able to use runes with him. He's going to walk right into that fucking trap. I see this coming a mile away. 
Unless he's got the light foot perk with Requiem. I don't know if it changes him. Yeah, look at it. Look at the blood. <laughs> he's crawling back to me. I think he's mad. You, uh... You okay there? I, um, I can't talk to him. Well, let's, let's wait an hour. Yes. Whatever happens next, I'm with you, my friend. We may not be keeping him. We may be leaving him behind. We may be going solo with this. Because if I can't use my runes, these guys aren't gonna have anything good. It's well. I mean, if he gets downed from something other than me, that's gonna be a problem. an ebony sword, buddy. Our time together is proving mutually beneficial, I think. I am glad to be by your side. Oh, it does. damage from you. Oh boy. Not you. Ah oh, shit. And I'm out of stamina. Which is which is a major problem. Ow. Okay. He seems to be okay. I'm a, bit sore. I'm a bit sore too, buddy. Let's let's have five. Yeah, they're not gonna have anything interesting. That's the other thing, too. Uh, you can't change direction with Sky Resouls. You just have to, like, walk and... I don't know, it's one of those mods I could do without. I may take it out. There's no plug-in for it, so... Bloody. Okay, let us see what we have. Can Indigo die? No. Nope. Yeah, he's uh, he's essential. You can't. Uh... 
can't uh, you can't kill him. Even if I were to use the console to uh, to hit kill, it, it, he'll just go into a bleed out state. That's it. I'll just have to be a little more careful with them, I guess. No runes with him. I'll have to make him wait. Uh, let Fallward pick the lock. You think it is for the best. Can you pick that? I am with you, my friend. Oh, nice. Sweet. I oh, will have him pick the locks. Flawless di- wow. Nice. <sighs> we may go solo. Honestly, he's gonna get in my way with my spell slinging. I think once we get back to town, we're gonna take the stuff off him. And let him go back to Riften. Or make him wait somewhere. I didn't have a big, uh, a big plan to use him. It's just one of those things we sort of did when we were in Riften. So there was no backstory. There was no anything. So whether I use him or not really doesn't matter. If you're gonna dump him, make sure he's neutered. <laughs> Uh, would it be possible to use Jay's mod that lets you use potions to heal followers? I could probably add it in. I thought I did, Anna, but I... But then I'd be... Yeah, I'd have to make all a bunch of potions for him too, wouldn't I? That's annoying. Unless he pulls them out of nowhere. the archer. Good job. Oop. That's why you checked them. He's gonna have enough arrows. I, I don't even know if we need to... Yeah, we'll probably never need to make any more from him. He's got enough. Drop a save. It uses your potions. Uh. Well, that's not good either. Because I don't want him taking them out of mine if he's, if he's going to use them every little time he gets hurt. Howdy's. What a pain in the ass. Yeah, he's hurting. Me. 
Hey, you missed there, guy. No, no, no. I know you are. <laughs> ah! I almost walked right into him. Oh, he's a beefy boy. Uh, where is he? That's some fire. We're going down here. They above, they're above me. Ah. Whoa. That was a two for one sale. Hi. You're dead. It is dark in here now. I did not think I was going to survive that. Hopefully, it goes okay. He's probably downed in the next room. F5. There he is. Alright. was fucking impressive. You and I are gonna stand up and cheer. <laughs> Is that wind? So that's why I use healing hands. Of course I run with a bullet of followers. Kaiden's oh gee, yeah, Kaiden pretty much just wrecks everything by himself. He's pretty impressive. There are look at them all. Note to self, don't use that. Single fire some bolts. And you'll be fine. Take a potion. We got nine of them left. Do I have anything for stamina? I have to. Go. You want to go get any of them? Ah, jeez. You know what's going to happen. They're going to come over here. Yes, they are. I don't like you. Get away. Ah, oh, shit. Uh, not where I wanted to go. My energies aren't enough. My energies are sort of enough. Hi. Get away. Oh, I missed. <laughs> Ha 
There. Oh. Oh, am I taking my hood off? No wonder I didn't put the damn ore on. Hold on. Hold on a second. I think I fudged that myself. Yeah, you're walking through my fire, dummy. Alright, let's take a beef stew. Yeah, eight is my hood. Let's let's leave my hood on that. We want the hood on. Are we good? We're good. F five. That's all of them. Right? Please tell me that's all of them. Uh, Requiem changes. I don't think there's any more treasure on this side. Yep, see? It's gone. There's none on the other side, too. Oh, maybe there is. That one's gone. I know for a fact that one's gone. Uh, we kind of just saw it. No, there's another one. Not a shouty, are you? Ooh, smithing. Which doesn't matter to me whatsoever. Nice. That could have went really bad. I wonder if I give Inigo a... Would he like a mace? He looks better with a sword, doesn't he? We could sell that off. Right? Just sell that off. Okay, we have the dragon stone. Let us get out of here now, please. We are. We're leaving. Oh no, the chest is here. It's probably locked though, right? Oh. Did it move it? They're both on this side now, I guess. Wow, look at all the ice in here. It's kind of crazy. Orcish helmet of major alteration. That's, uh, that's a good thing. We'll stick that on frost. They're not for us, but... I don't think there's any more. Are there any more in here? Hello, any more Draugr? No more Draugr. Time. Two in the AMs. Okay, let's go out to Skyrim. What's up, Daisy? And fish named Mustard. Who else did I miss while I was fighting in there? Welcome in, guys. The dialogue with the followers. Oh yeah, they're they're banter together. Oh yeah, absolutely. Nice. Look at that. Grab it! <laughs> Back to gazing up at the moons. The dragon feeding ground. Yeah, snow looks... You know what that is? That's EMB light, too. 
from my, uh... Oh, no, I don't have my... I don't have my vial belt on. Let's see how it looks. Hold on. You know what it's from? It's, from, it's the glow from my spells. For my magic uh, effects. Your hands have them. And you know what that's from? That's from Ember's XD. There's an option. It's not ticked. You have to manually tick it yourself. Um, it gives a uh, a little bit of a glow to the to your hands. Although I am wondering, since it's this color, that's because of the moons, or is it just the glow in general? Because it's not out now, but it is there. <laughs> that's weird. Yeah, snow looks normal. We're, we're good. I'm convinced it was the light uh, for my lantern. Also from the torch. Where'd it go? Oh, that's not cool, man. Stupid rabbit. All right, let's let's sleep. Let's actually make a campfire, which we haven't done. And I don't know if I could do it here. There's slaughter fish like right there. I don't know if it'll let me. Let's try it. Uh, we can't. He's got my inigo. Where are you, dude? Where you at? I see him. He's holding the torch. Isn't that him? That's too far. Inigo, where the hell are you? Oh, did he try coming down the mountain? Did he get stuck? I bet he did. Hurry up you, Roger. Uh, poor bunny. No, not poor bunny. They had it coming. It's all their fault. That looks really good. Where the hell is he? Eh. Yeah, I hear him. Yeah, you want to get off that mountain? What are you doing? He's hiding in a bush. He's probably going to the bathroom. He knows I'm coming to look for him. Hurry up with that duke, Inigo. Let's go. He's on the mountain. He can't get down, can he? You're standing right here. Whoa. Bro, we just hugged. Why don't you, uh, why don't you come down? You, uh, yeah, that's interesting. Eh. Oh, that's right, I can run right through them, can I? Yeah. Oh, there he goes. You did it. Good for you. We should probably drop that dragonstone off in Whiterun as soon as possible. I have a horrible feeling it attracts the undead. Does Frost have the tent? Uh, Frost may have the tent. I will bear your burdens gladly. I don't know. Let's check Inigo first. Inigo's got the tent. <sighs> I don't think I gave him any firewood, though, did I? If you need anything else, just ask. Now you know what? Let's just, because I don't have, I don't have Frostfall active. There's no needs mods. It's kind of pointless to do this, isn't it? Start up uh, campfires options just to, to not really use it. It's blended in there pretty good, I think. Like, when you're up close looking at it, it looks better. And if you stand away, it's like, oh, is that a scene? No, it's... I blended it in the best I could. 
considering I don't do anything with the texture. These look good. Still can't get over how good this, this parallax is here. I could have done a better job with this one. Well, maybe not. I don't know. It's kind of okay. I think it's just the game limitations, honestly. Because I like that. I like that looking clay, like the reddish clay. Let's just, we'll go to Riverwood. We have a claw for somebody, probably. figure this out you can go back on it I don't think that aura that we picked up the uh, Sunfire spell I could probably take that off maybe we'll need it in the future I don't know we'll keep the ward keep soul trap Yeah, see, that's the the downside of not using a particle lantern. If I swapped Elderberry and I could show you the difference, you wouldn't have that. But like again, that's just a limitation. Oh, it's just a small child. <laughs> okay. here huh yeah we never actually asked you what was going on did we now oh, we are really tall the riverwood trader is everything you need in a general store of course the imperials aren't that big uh what happened uh, yeah we, we did have a bit of a, a break in we, we still have plenty to sell robbers were only after one thing an ornament solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw Oh yeah, this one? You found it! <laughs> there it is! Strange. It, it seems smaller than I remember. <laughs> Watch, don't hit your head on that ceiling, right? I'm gonna put this <laughs> back where it belongs. I'll he is, he's really tall. This. You've done a great thing for me and my I'm, sister. I'm pretty sure Requiem changes their height. Uh, okay. Thank you so much. 70 experience. Wow, 500 teams. septums too. Nice. The Riverwood Trader is back to the way it used to be. We're almost at another level. Uh, let's see what you got. Take a look. All right. Uh, we've got some things of ice, don't we? That's a Hones one. We may give that to him. I'm saving that. Uh, what else? We, we picked up enough bottles of water. Ah, books. Not really. Keep the flawless stuff, right? Do we need linen wraps? I don't know.
Till next Excuse time. Me. I think he's got everything. In it go. Speak to me. Would you rather the axe? What is yours is mine. So Luca needs a uh, bottle contract with those guys, right? Looks good. You can have those. The sword is 66. Oh, we can take that bow. And I don't really, well, I mean, they're the same as the ancient Nor. Let's just get rid of them. You still like that sword, huh? You like that sword over the axe? You're a weird fellow. What else do you have? How many lockpicks do I have? Do I don't even need this many. Let me take those. Yeah, and it gives him like a bunch of cell key. I don't know why. That's a... Uh, that's a Requiem thing, too. Although, I've seen that happen before, Reese. He's got a bunch. Daddy's in the car, Molly. Let's see here. Yeah, see that? And then if you give him that one, it, it populates a bunch. See that? What if I give him that one? Same thing. Alright, so we're... We're good on that. We keep a key. He keeps a bunch of keys. <laughs> All set? Uh, maybe. Uh, Lucan. You and me. We're the only people around who aren't complete fools. Yeah, it goes awesome. Some may call. He just he doesn't like my runes though. Call them treasures. Let's let's just leave it at that. He doesn't like my runes. So a silver die katana, huh? I wonder if we could break that down and make uh, like a one-handed silver. Because if I could use a one-handed silver weapon, that'd be fantastic. Even if it's just a dagger. Lucan, do you have anything that I might... Uh... No, you don't really, do you? You're, you're kind of a butthole. Enraging orb. Next time. That's the problem. Oh, he's got a coin purse for me. And you've got some elves ears. This for sure. looks friendly enough. Maybe we should put our weapons away. Ah, good to see you. <laughs> Candlelight. Get away from me. All right, let's let's favorite that. Candlelight, you're you're now eight. So candlelight's it works a little different. It, it's like permanently on. Well, 425 seconds for a single cast. Um, let, let me put my hood on. So if I dual cast it, how long does that stay for? 15, 16 minutes. Let's see how it looks outside instead of using my light. Let's we'll see how the, the candlelight looks. We'll have to check it in the snow. I think just to dispel it, you just recast it. Is that how it works? Yep. It's just a little more expensive. That's all. I don't know, I'll have to think about that. Fuck it, let's just go right to White Run. Uh, let's get Frost. Frost, come on.
Maybe we'll go up. We'll go, we'll go see if there's any. Uh, we'll check the snow up here. Should have killed this wolf, right? The downside is it's raining. It's hard to really gauge it at this point. Uh, here, let me. I don't know if that'll work. No, it doesn't work. Not on a horse. <laughs> Oh well, it's good enough. Ah, oh, and the rain stopped. Didn't somebody make a mod to uh, allow spell casting on horseback? Was that another one? I could have sworn it was. Can we not fit through that wide open gate? What about this one? They did, huh? You guys know the name of it? That would be uh, something I'd like to uh, add to this. Alright, you. What do you have? That's right, you've got all my ingredients. Um, stuff to sell. I kind of need these. Oh boy. Nobody's awake yet, though. That's the problem. Alright, you, uh, you hang out there. Farangar. He may be sleeping too, but at least we can get into his room. Uh, it's right hand only, but useful. Oh, it's okay, Karma. No worries. No worries. It's not a like a super rush or anything. I just I remembered seeing somebody. Uh, I don't know if they were talking about it or if they're like they're the ones that created it. As far as like other animations go, I do have like the fixes in for like the dual wielding combat, um, which you could all, again, if you're, it's noticeable in third person. It's not as noticeable in first. The lights hitting that. Um, yeah. See. Just after the Dragon War. If so, I could use this to cross reference the names with other later texts. Good. I'm glad you're making progress. My employers are anxious to have some tangible answers. Oh, have no fear. 
He kind of doesn't really look like a high elf, does he? I was playing with this. I don't know. Maybe it's the light, but I was playing with his skin tone. Running Barngar, don't forget. This isn't some theoretical question. Dragons have come back. Yes, yes. Don't worry. Although the chance to see a leaping dragon up close would be tremendously bountiful. Now let me show you something else I found. Very intriguing. I think your employers may be interested as well. Hmm? Bah! Yes, a Jarl's protege. We got nothing. Well, no. <laughs> you didn't die, it seems. No, I didn't die. Ah, jerk. Dragon Stone of Bleak Falls Barrow. That's my level right there. 85 XP, baby. Uh, well, I got you the stone. What, what's next? That is where your job ends and mine begins. The work of the mind, sadly undervalued in Skyrim. The work of the mind. My associate here will be pleased to see your handiwork. She discovered Looks Dunmer. By means Looks like Carl so Urban. To share with me. So your information was correct after all. I'm gonna have to and look up who that is. Friend here to thank for recovering it for us. You went into Bleak Falls Barrow and got that. Nice work. Just send me a copy when you've decided. What's up with her eyes? I wonder what Iraleth is so excited about. Oh. Dragon's been sighted nearby. You should come too. A dragon? How exciting. Where was it seen? What, what Where the hell is Iraleth? I'd take this a bit more seriously if I were you. If a dragon decides to oh. wife on me. She, she popped right in behind me. I didn't even see her. <laughs> Look at her. She's all geared up in that nice, heavy ebony. You gonna tell the story guard? I wanna hear this. Come on. So, Irileth tells me you came from the Western Watchtower? Yes, my lord. Tell him what you told me about the dragon. No, that's right. You saw it coming from the south. It was false. Faster than anything I've ever seen. What did it do? Is it attacking the Watchtower? No, Who's a smelly cat? Who's a smelly cat? Sorry. <laughs> it's like, good work, no. Is that Nazim? Or is that Preventus? I have a hard time telling. That's Preventus. Good. Don't fail me. Uh, There's so Carl no Urban played. Ceremony, my friend. I need your help uh, again. Uh, lo I want you uh, to go Lord of the Rings. And help her Bones and Star Trek. You 2009 and Dread and Dread. So you have more experience with dragons than anyone else okay. here. But I have Billy Butcher and the Boys. You did for me in retrieving the dragon stone for far and I think it is Nazim. It very well could be. As a token of my esteem. I don't know. No, now that I'm looking at it, it's Preventus. Nazim's got the. He doesn't have the, the gray outfit. He's got the. Accept this gift. The tan ones. Personal armory. Help your left kill this Surpassing. Ooh, resist no. fire, resist magic. It's like he control. knows. I need you here working on ways to defend the city against. Ten XP, huh? As you command. One last thing, Irelet. This isn't a death or glory mission. I need to know what we're dealing with. As Preventus. Don't worry, my lord. I'm the very soul. Ready for a little dragon slaying, my friend? I guess so. What are we trading? Uh. Am I giving you anything? That silver die katana. I wanted to break that down. Let us go kill a dragon. You want to kill a dragon? All right. All right. Seven in the morning. That's the perfect time to go kill dragons. It's a little foggy out, though. You ready, Yurla? Don't mind me, I'm gonna stop off at the forge first. Do we still have a blessing? We had what? We had Zenithar for a while, right? We have it's, it's a 24 hour blessing, I believe. Yeah, we got another 17 hours of this blessing. Whoa. 
I think I... Either my game did something funky or I actually took my hand off the W key. Alright. I think it was just me. Oh, you can! Sweet. Alright. Let's see if I can make a silver... Alright, you talk to them. What I need to make a dagger. There's that silver dagger. Ooh, there's a silver Tonto. Uh, I need a steel ingot. Okay. Adrian. I need a steel ingot, please. yourself or deal some damage. One ingot. Good luck out there. A family. That's perfect. Ah, that looks better. It's silver. If you're with me. Now what do you say? Shall we go? That's That's perfect. All right. Yeah, we're going to take candlelight off. I don't think I'm going to be using that. So we'll put the hood. Hoodie, you go back on 8 so I can take you on and off because I'm weird and I like doing stuff like that. Come on. Oh, fine. You yeah, you, you all go out there. I'm, I'm trying, just trying to open the door here. Idiots. <laughs> What's up, bees? Welcome in. Welcome, welcome. Uh, let's make sure we level up, because I don't know how much experience uh, we're going to have. Frost, you're going to stay here. I don't want you going near a dragon. How many points do we have? 49. So let's um, let's look at this here. At the next level, we'll have 50, which is uh, which is pretty good. Uh, I'm going to go Alteration. Okay, I'm going to have one left. And I can't really do anything with four, can I? No, I cannot. Because now it costs me five. So what are we going with? Magic, right? We're going to hold on to the perk, because next level, destruction is where are you? You're going to open up 50. You're going to have one for impact. Um, Pyromancy 2 is 50. They burn with almost otherworldly heat, consume earth and flesh with terrifying ease. Or, um, you develop... More powerful rune spells and have unlocked the secret of maintaining three active runes instead of just one. Uh, we very well may be doing this. Oh, you know what else? No, I'm sorry. Before we do runes, Adept is 50. So, save. So, yeah. So, we're going to get um, Impact and Adept. Destruction is our main skill after all so why am I wasting that when I have a healing that nah, doesn't matter <laughs> you know that our supply is limited perhaps you have encountered a prasad both are sworn Rizarum, welcome in where the goods to offer welcome welcome I need to see your wares take a look thank you thank you thank you uh since Inigo doesn't want this, and I'm sure we're going to pick up ice over the many... Oh, yeah, and you can have this too. We don't need this. What else do we have? I don't think to use some of these. Oh, the skooma. Inigo said to get rid of the skooma. We get rid of the skooma.
I don't think we need linen wraps for anything. We'll just toss them out. Same with the saber cat pelts. Do we need these? I don't think we need these. I don't know how much we get for them. Not a lot. We'll keep the ingot. Definitely keep the ebony. That's eight carry weight right there. Um, here, you can have this. This. Um, have that. 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 Thanks. Oh. We'll, we'll be back. We're gonna go fight a dragon. Feel free to help us out. So, arcane word for the dragon fire, maybe. Where are they over here? No sign of any dragon right now. Sure looks like oh, I should have made potions. We've got to figure out the rest of today is out there beyond the mist. Do we have any? Let's go get it. I don't think we have Spread any regions to it. We need to know what. All right, let's put that on. Healing's not really gonna help me, so. Should have picked up that archer. I didn't think about it. Rocky and Tor just got grabbed when they tried to make a run for it. Godman, what happened here? Where's this dragon? Yeah, where's Quickly the Durgan? I don't know. Yeah, I didn't mean to do that. Fighting him in the fog, this isn't gonna be fun. Oh wow. It might be fun. I legit can't see him, and he doesn't have a red marker, he's got a, uh, an icon. Fire work on him? I don't think fire works on him. Uh. Oh boy. I'm coming in, boys. Damn it. And it goes down. I can't tell. I don't think it's working on him. We may need the crossbow. This sucks. <laughs> Yeah, these guys are toast. That's a high grade. Uh. All right, any poisons? Nah, why? Why would we, right? Oh! Well, there goes my weapon. Uh. Ow. Fuck. 
He just whacked me with his wing. He's like, screw you, dude. <laughs> it is not a forest dragon. That word is taboo here. <laughs> I don't think my fire works on him. Right? I mean, these guys don't have anything. They just have bone meal and... Where the hell is he? He's got 10,000. Oh, maybe that did work. I don't know. Let's try, watch. Does that look like it's working? Or maybe it is. I can't really tell. I'll be able to tell when I'm the only one. That's your left. Yeah, it looks like it's working. Alright. Yeah, hers is working too. In it go. I think he's down. Yeah, he's down. Slay him, I don't really see him. Oh, there he is. She's going nuts with her spear. It's it's working, it's just not it's just not a lot. I think most of that was hers. Her lightning is no joke. Better find out what just happened. I have no idea. F5 just happened. Oh, no, I want you talking to me inside the skeleton. That's a weird thing. I can't believe it. You're Dragonborn. Ah, welcome back, Asuni. Come back to watch the glorious battles. And Miscreant, welcome in. Enjoy your lurk. Uh, what, what are you talking about? In the very oldest tales, back from when there were still dragons in Skyrim, the dragonborn would slay dragons and steal their power. That's I wonder if I have to change Inigo's aggression. He's not the attacking. Power. I don't know if that's a Requiem thing. Like, he tries to. I, like, I don't... And I, I have the patch between the two. There's only one way to find out. Try to shout. That will prove. According to the old legends, only the Dragonborn can shout without training, the way the dragons do. That'll be nice to be able to shout. What are you talking about? Yeah, what are you talking about? That's right. My grandfather used to tell stories about the Dragonborn. Those born with the dragon blood. Like old Tiber Septim, he said. I've never heard of Tiber Septim. <laughs> dragons. There weren't any dragons then, idiot. Yeah, we are talking about for a high elf in the size. The in forever. And they're all Nords. But the old tales tell of the Dragonborn who Kill dragons and steal the power. You must be one. What do you say, Yelena? Being awfully quiet. Come on, Yelena. Fighting him in the fog was actually pretty cool. Do you believe in this dragonborn business? <laughs> Some of you would be better off keeping quiet than flapping your gums on matters you don't. Surprisingly, that's the 4K uh, bones. Here's a dead dragon, and that's something I definitely understand. 
They're probably up their resolution a little bit because they kind of don't look good. Someone who can put down a dragon is more than enough for me. You wouldn't understand, Housecon. That's interesting. I've been all across Tamriel. I've seen plenty of things just as out Like the skull looks good, right? I'd advise you all to trust That nah, looks alright. I'll have to go back and look. I, I think that's Gamwich's. Must be. You really are Dragonborn, then. Yeah, what do you think? That was the hairiest fight I've ever been in. Yeah. And I've been in more than a few. She looks good. I don't know about this Dragonborn business, but I'm sure glad you're with us. You better get back to White Run right away. Yarl Bagra will want to know what happened here. There's Frost. Alright, let's go, Frost. Back to White Run. I think it's ironic that we're wearing illusion robes and I have no illusion spells. Like, I don't even have illusion perked. I, I've been using my points in it, of course, but at some point we will. That's crazy. Ah, look at him, look up. <laughs> Burelum. Boy, that looks really good. Not the horse's butt, the uh, white run in the fog. Unless you're looking at the horse's butt and you like it, in which case you're a weirdo. Yeah, too too tall for that portcullis, I think. That's a that's a fortified. White runs issue because nothing else is modifying that aside from my height. Altmer here, look at this. Yeah, we're we're hitting our head on that. I think even if he was regular sized, it wouldn't matter. Spiked in the head. Yeah, the robe looks fantastic. We're we're gonna get another robe. We're, we're gonna get a better robe. Look, you've already been told you're not allowed here. Uh, I just like the blue. We're causing no trouble. All we ask is to look for her. I don't care what you're doing. Yeah, see, that's what um. Did it. Requiem changes the guard's armor, so I don't even need a mod for that. This is not over. Spare coin for a banger. Don't care. Do not care. I love that dagger. Look at that dagger. See, yeah, like I said, if I put the uh, the 4K parallax benches, she doesn't sit right on them. She sits like off them. So I left them out. I think this looks fine as it is. I'd like to get it where I don't even have to wear the backpack, though. Let's see, what time are we at today? We're at... 5... Almost 5, five hours and 40 minutes. Yeah, I don't want to go 8.5 hours like I did yesterday. But there are a few things I need to do. I like the eye. I didn't think I liked the eye adaptation as much yesterday, but I do like it. You heard the summons. What else could it mean? The Greybeards. You were just talking about you. My brother. Oh, good. I hope, right? So what happened at the Watchtower? Was the dragon there? Oh yeah, yeah. The Watchtower was destroyed, but we killed the dragon. I knew I could count on Irelet, but there must be more to it than that. Uh. 
Yeah, when the dragon died, I had some, oh, they did call me Dragonborn. Yeah, it turns out I might be something called a Dragonborn. Dragonborn? Yeah. What do you know about the Dragonborn? Get right by the kid with the sharp object. Critique the furniture. What could go wrong? <laughs> Jeez. Uh, yeah, when the dragon died, I observed some kind of power. So it's true. Yeah. The Greybeards really were summoning you. The who? Greybeards? Masters of the Way of the Voice. They live in seclusion, high on the slopes of the throat of the world. Interesting. What do they want with me? The Dragonborn is said to be uniquely gifted in the voice. Balgraf, you have really Ability good teeth your vital for somebody in this age and time. If you really are Dragonborn, he must be using that new charcoal paste. Did you hear the thundering sound as you returned to Whiterun? That was the voice of the Greybeards, summoning you to High Rothgar. This hasn't happened in centuries, at least. Not since Tybersepdim himself was summoned when he was the Talos of Ahora. Rungar, calm yourself. What does any of this Nord nonsense have to do with our friend here? Capable as he may be, I don't see any signs of him being this, what, dragon. <laughs> Jarl Balgriff. Nord Balgriff the Gleamier. Why, you puffed up ignorant. These are our sacred traditions that go back to the founding of the First Empire. Prongar. And we still have those weird boots that we had in the beginning of the game. I meant no disrespect, of course. What are they? It's just, just plain old, what are these gray plain brown want? boots, literally. That's the Greybeard's business. They don't go with this outfit at all. Whatever happened when Look at you killed that. that dragon, it revealed something in you. We're gonna have to that sort that out. They think you're Dragonborn. Who are we to argue? You'd better get up to High Hrothgar immediately. There is no refusing the summons of the Greybeards. It's a tremendous honor. I envy you, you know. You climb the 7,000 steps again. I made the pilgrimage once. Did you know that? High Hrothgar is a very peaceful place. Considering Skyrim doesn't have a single dentist, right? I wonder if the Greybeards even notice what's Could you imagine? They haven't seemed to care before. No matter. Go to High Rock. Assume that, you know, they rotted out, they fell out, they got infected. Of course, they were eating different things back then, too, so. By my right is Yarl. I name you Thane of White Run. It's the greatest honor that's within my power to grant. I assign you Lydia I'll as take a it. personal house car, and this weapon from my armory to serve as your badge of office. I'll also notify my guards of your oh, new the pressure, pressure, pressure. Want them to Oh my god, that song's gonna be stuck in my head now. We are honored to have you as Thane of our city, Dragonborn. Back to business, Momentus. We still have a city to defend. Yes, my lord. So let's see, this should just be, what does Requiem do with the axe? It's not going to have a, a great model, it's just going to be a Nordic one. Fire damage. Alright. In it go. Would you like the axe of white... You like that orcish sword I gave you, don't you? I mean, it, that even matches your outfit. <sighs> Congratulations on becoming a Thane, my friend. You wear the title well. I believe what the face like. You have any thoughts? This is a roomy place. It makes me want to sing and dance and chase my tail. Do not worry, I will control myself. You give me best equipment. Yeah, I'd, yes. I'd like to give you something a little bit better than, you know, this orchestra. You seem to love this. 66. I think because it's orcish. That's literally it. That's 72. Does he equip that? No. See that? He still likes this. Even though this is 72, I could take this away. Right? I could. You're a pain in my ass, Inigo. He's got enough arrows. He's fine. Let's F5. Let's let's figure this out. See you, Rongar. 
Oh, yeah, we need the bounty. The other thing we came here for. Good to see you. Um, the leader at Valtheim is dead. Here to collect. Excellent. You've done us a great service. Here's the question. Here is your reward. All right, so we got another 500 septums. We could buy Breeze home for three. We don't have enough for the Tundra homestead. I, I need a place. How much money do we have? Let's see. Enjoy your visit to Dragon's Reach. We got five. All right, I'm gonna have to think about this. Divine I don't don't go anywhere. May the ground you walk quake as you Now pass. I don't have anything modding Breeze Home. That's another thing to write down on the list. Mod for Breeze Home. Um. I almost feel like it's a waste. Considering I would need it for, like, making potions, because we can go to Arcadia's. Well, we got the alchemy lab in the house, if I take it. Plus, that bases me around Whiterun. Right? Now, there's two mage homes. Um, well, they're, they're more mage homes. Right, I know you're looking at me, Preventus. Uh... Gallows Hall and Mirwatch. Mirwatch is more of the actual mage home. But it's free. But it's in Kelmarch. But it's free. And I, I'm, I'm not really a fan of the Tundra homestead. I actually would prefer Breeze home. Yeah, we're going to save our money. Even though any more I, I kind of need it. Just let me know. Oh, let's look at the journal here. Oh yeah, I have to speak to the Arl of Ruth. Didn't do that either, huh? Let's see how Miss Lydia looks. Has appointed me to be your well, she doesn't look bad. It's an honor to serve you. It's no Pandorables, but it works. Uh, what does a house carl do? As my fame, I'm sworn to your service. I'll guard you and all you own. But it's in the swamp. But it's free. She looks normal. She looks good. Yeah, like she's got um. I, they're not. I mean, I guess are they beauty marks or that's just her skin? The skin texture looks really good with this. She could use some slight wrinkles in the forehead, but I don't know. How old is Lydia supposed to be? Does anybody ever, like, is, it, is there canon on her for her age? I, I don't assume her to be, like, in her 20s. But with the voice, it sounds a little different, you know? I'm really digging the eye mod, though. The eyes look really good. Everybody's eyes look fantastic. We're not taking her with us. I don't need another follower. We've already got Goofy over here. And I don't have a follower framework. You're going to hang out here and mm -hmm. yeah, you're going to go do Lydia things over there. Sit there until the end of time. You have dialogue with her, don't you? You want me to take her with you. Fine. Oh, I can't. I don't think I can. Lead the way. Oh, I guess I can. All right. Hello, Lydia. We have not been properly introduced yet. My name is Inigo. Hello? Where are you? He's Over here. Right there. I am the blue thing talking to you. The blue thing? Oh, hi. It's very nice to meet you. Likewise. Are you feeling okay? You seem distracted. What were we talking about? I was just saying, you seem a bit distracted. I am. I've got some fresh cabbage. How did this happen? I'm thinking of making some apple cabbage stew. Uh, 48 to be exact. Okay. I will Is she really? Your thoughts. I would not have expected her to be 48. Turnips next. Or maybe radishes? I'm, tr I'm oh, trusting that... Her sword arm works better than her head. Jeez. Are you? <laughs> I mean, she looks even with this overhaul, she looks younger. 
Now the base game, you can't go by the base game's looks because, let's be honest, the base game looks like shit. But how many replacer mods have you seen where it's like, Lydia looks like a 17 or 18 year old, like, child. And then some of them, you know, they're more mature. Where I guess that, I guess, you know, if she is 48, she'd look her age. I still say that's like early to mid 30s, maybe mid 30s. And you don't count because you're you're a tall cat. <sighs> See what we're dealing with. <laughs> All right, monkey. Inigo made me like vanilla Lydia. Yeah. Um. Her her dialogue edits, like her add-on for it, is really good if you don't have Inigo. And you're able to tone it down. Otherwise, she's speaking like every five seconds, and it's really fucking annoying. Like, it's really annoying. Small child. What's up, John Battleborn? Let's check the, uh, the missives board. I need more money. Letter to Rorikstead. Letter to Left Hand Mine. Collect petty... No, no, no. Weapon to Riften. Potion to Markarth. Gather Wolfheart. We do have to go to Markarth, though, don't we? This is going to be from Arcadia. I also want to go to the college. And I was also hoping that there'd be something on here to take me into uh, the Morthal area. <clears throat> she doesn't really have any in-world lore, so who knows how old she really is. Ah! Starting to like the NPC replacers that don't make them look like they stepped off. Yeah, same, same Yuki. I, uh... If I'm following a guide, it is, it's almost a guarantee that you're going to have runway models for both the guys and the girls. When, when I do, like, my own setup, like, stuff like this, right? Like, the way that you see my game now with how the NPCs look, that's usually how I do it. Um, I went a long time just using, like, the diversity mod. With, like, the custom, like, the custom hairs version. Because uh, I think they look fine. And then for a while, I was literally just basing them all off high poly head. And really good skins. This time I'm running um, Courageous Women and what's it called? Pride of Skyrim? With no high poly head. And of course, you know. It's a little easier. Inigo's got his own separate replacer. But she falls under Courageous Women. And I obviously like John here. He's under pride. The guards are all just touched by the skins and everything else, but like his solda. Right? Hello there. again. Hi. Okay. And of course now they're they're being overwritten by the I mod, which I, I really like. I'll probably continue to use this I mod. I'll never forget you. There's Carlotta. What do you need, my friend? If I can get some light on you, see? Like perfectly fine. Hair's, uh, it's a touch darker, um, which I like. When we saw her the other day, there wasn't as much light around, and it actually looked like black black, and I'm like, did something mess up? But it's, it's a darker texture. That's all it is. Take care of yourself. And like Inoriath, too, for a Bosmer, too, and then you see he's got, like, the really nice red eyes, but also, like, what, what the hair and everything does to him. It doesn't look, like, overly done, but they still look good. That's sort of the point, right? Like, we want them to look good. And I do have... I have BNP skins over RS children. I work with my mother. Uh, Mila. Who's this, Lars? So, RS children, and then the BNP for RS children. The patch. So they don't look like potatoes. They got a little satchel there. How's Mila look? Did you 
know there's some fruits that actually You won't actually look at me, so I gotta get like right up and I'm really tall and you're like, wow. He's always like, I'm telling your mother that creepy looking elf is looking at your daughter funny. You there. We're looking for Same with the Alec here too. You will pay good money for information. That's hard to tell, but a woman, a foreigner in these lands. Red girl like us. She's likely not uh, We will pay for any information. I'm not even gonna pronounce that Kasuni. I know who We're that is though. I, I recognize the name, I mean. So we will be in Fabulous Rome followers Rome. AIO. Yeah, if I tried to pronounce it, I'd, I'd butcher the fuck out of it. <laughs> uh, why are you looking for this person? It's none of your concern. All you need to what know jerk. is that we're paying for information. If that doesn't interest you, feel free to walk away. Fine. She cannot hide from us forever. We're, we're gonna walk away, Inigo. Lydia, do we need to give you anything? Let's see. Since you're with Still us here? now. I know, I know you're here. Um, it's an honor to serve you. I have terrible smithing. All right, so you do have a helmet. I don't want her wearing this helmet, and I don't have. Um, I'm gonna add nethers for tomorrow, guys. I never do this. I probably should have this in to begin with. I was really planning on going solo. The finest weapons and armor. I really don't want her wearing that stuff. We're gonna, you know, we're gonna loot stuff. Why am I even paying for this? It's light. That'll look good for uh, Inigo. Chainmail? Alright, anyway. Let's get out of here. Good we'll luck, loot man. stuff for her. <laughs> Actually, I have a really good idea for what we're gonna dress the two of them in. Now I make her house Carl somewhere else. All right, you ready, Frost? All right, let's um let's sort of prep a little bit. I still have to make. All right, we'll do this in third person because I know that first person is a little jarring. I don't mind it, but I'm sure it bugs some of you guys. If I switch, uh, I guess I can't. Yes, I can switch to FOV. See, this doesn't bother me. Well, let's wait. Let's see here. How tall are we? Yeah, we're. Uh, oh, jeez. Even if we were the regular height, we're still whacking our head on that. Look at that. That's a pork. That pork call us. Get rid of it. That's. Bleed that out of fortified. You don't need that. I know why it's there. So let's see. High Rothgar's there. Shroudhearth is there. We could go back to Riften. I have got a couple things to do there. Viria. We gotta talk to uh, Sibby. I haven't figured out what I'm going to wind up doing about that. Sid gear, the ritual site, those are the necromancers. Uh, well, Andrew is soul gem, and then... Uh, what's the one, the Orichalcum ingot? Yeah, the ingot from the frozen hearth. We've got nothing in Morthal. It's it's literally in the middle of nowhere. Like, why the mage one would be out in the swamps? I guess the apprentice stone is there. We don't have anything in solitude. The purchase agreement to Klepper. There's Hendraheim. I mean, Hendraheim is free. Not very magey, but it's, it's it's free. It's near Granite Hill. It's 
in between White Run and Falkreath and Markar, well, it's actually not in a bad location. Hendraheim is cursed. Why is it cursed? Put them in matching fishing outfits. Oh my god. Like, you could put Indigo in anything and he'd probably make it look good. Putting Lydia in a fishing outfit? Oh my god. <laughs> could you imagine? I'm sure somebody's done. Somebody's walking around with a whole fishing party. There's somebody on the internet somewhere that's either streams or does videos that their Skyrim is nothing but fishermen. That's it. Right? You can attack with the poles, can't you? Hold on. I gotta get off and try it. I have one on me. I'm pretty sure you can. Right? You use it as like a sword, right? Can you improve this? Somebody tell me you can improve this damage. <laughs> Put chaos enchant on it. <laughs> I have my next build. <laughs> it's the worst weapon in the game. Like, worse than the fork and the knife? Those can't be improved. I, Wind, you played with the with the fork and the knife, right? With Jiggy. You chanted those things, right? For those that don't know, the Wind... Um, let me give you a, another shout out, Wind. Go to her, go to her channel, but then uh, she's got her YouTube linked as well. I'm sure she's got it archived. She played a character called Jiggy. Jiggy was... <laughs> Let's just... <laughs> he was a cheese fanatic. How would you describe Jiggy? It was one of the most entertaining series I've ever watched. The fishing rod of doom. We need a... Uh, no, I don't need you to wait. You know, we need we need a mud crab, a juvenile mud crab. And there should be one right over here, I think, right? Or is this the guy that we picked up? Alright. We might have we might have picked him up. Uh frost. somehow make that over. They're archived. Oh, they're archived on Twitch. Okay, there you go. Uh, I highly recommend you guys uh, go check that out. <laughs> if if not for anything else, uh, the roleplay itself is spectacular. But the character is freaking hysterical. We already took that. Yeah, so this is definitely a Dindu lot issue. I tried um, two separate mushroom uh, mods for both meshes and textures and normally without running Dindalot active they are fine on the log right so then I re-ran Dindalot for the first one messed up I deleted that I tried the second mod on the log fine re-ran Dindalot a third time fucked that one up too so it's either a Dindalot setting on my end. There's a big burr. A big burr. There's the big burr. Really? Lydia, what are you doing? Yeah, between the two of them and my fire, that's not bad. We can get a bear heart. 
All right, let's go look for one of these little bastards. All right, they're like right by these things here, right? Or the rocks. Take that. I wonder if they're over by the giants. This is... Oh, boy, this is... This is going to be tough. Come here, you. You know, I bet there are. I bet there's one, but... Frost, you, you wait there. We were already through here, and he got aggroed, like, super quick. So if I don't see any, I don't see any. And, no, we're aggroing you. Alright, leave him alone. Come on, guys. So Hendraheim is cursed. Do we do we decide on why this isn't cursed, or why it is? Followers do, followers don't enter or exit. They turn invisible, and Inigo becomes a mannequin once, literally. Uh Did you clean the plugin? I had issues with a lot of my CC stuff. I cleaned them all. It fixed like 93% of the issues I had. Yeah, we want to be, we want to be off. I want to be picking these things up. Yeah, see how they're floating there? Doing a Morakai Dragon Priest build who uses Staff of Magnus uh, with Dereni Arcane spells. Is a pink eyed vamp, so like an albino vampire. I don't remember if I cleaned it, but all those things happen in different places. Oh! Uh, run them through the SSC Edit Quick Auto Clean. So if you have SSC Edit installed, uh, you have to install it to your mod manager as an executable. And then you're going to have two that you're going to use. The Quick Auto Clean is for anything that has, say, like. Identical to master records, uh, undeleted references, and nav issues. You want to clean them, because they can cause issues. Um, if it's something that needs manual cleaning, you have a second one in there, which is which is the big one, which is actually like SSCN itself, the program, what you saw me running through before uh, today. Um, and it's where you could check all the conflicts uh, in the game uh, for the plugins that you're, you're running. Conflicts not meaning a bad thing. Conflicts just meaning that like mod A conflicts with mod B and here's what it does, right? And you may want mod B's conflicts to win out. It just shows you the difference between what A has and what B has. And mod C maybe have something totally different and maybe it loads last. So maybe you need to put mod B after both A and C. Make sense? It's not as simple as that, but it can, it can be as simple as that. Um, I feel like even the people that created SSE Edit, was that Elminster? And uh, the whole team, I, I, I guarantee you they're all still learning about it too. Because the more I use it, the more shit that I pick up. The more. Let's check over here. There's mud crabs over here, right? With water. Almost positive. Yeah, right up here. I don't know. Didn't seem to. Where's the other? The other one's out in the middle. We're gonna need to ride you, Frost. We uh, we're a little uh, a little cucumbered. 
check down here. Huh. Random butterfly wings. Alright, we want to stay as far away from that fort as possible. Where are you? Come here. Let's go check in the middle of the tundra. I, I know I know a spot. Hopefully there's no saber cat there. I don't feel like getting thrown halfway across the tundra again. That wasn't fun. Because then you can never tell if you're dead or not. Like You know you got knocked over. You know you lost some health. Yeah, here's another one. Let's check down here. I think we killed the mud crabs here, right? Can I do this in first person or not really? No, no, juvenile's here. I think the other one's a little further up by the camp. There's my eek. Should be by like the the lad of the lake here, whatever it's called. This is the empty riverbed. It's further up. Not to knock on wood, guys, but we've gone. Let's see, what's eight and a half in 6.10 hours? Not a single crash. Ooh, I see fish. Yeah, like right here, right? There should be one here, somewhere. Ooh, we got a dwarven sword for Lydia. Hey, Lydia. You don't want that Yo, steel. Yeah. Oh, you look so ridiculous with that guard helmet. <laughs> Here's everything I have. Uh, I got a better sword for you. Would you like the Axe of White Run? Oh, thank God. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you that, and I'm gonna give you that silver. What? All right, you can have all three. Is there anything else you need? Thank God. So thank God somebody uses it in a go. Jerk. I guess we may have to go towards Rorikstead to find it. We found there was a little crab. He was like right outside Whiterun, right? And once I got the uh, Orcish Arrow? Who has Orcish Arrows? Are there bandits over there? Let's see. We cleared that out. Oh no, they're fighting there. Who are they fighting? Oh, that's where he landed. Did you see that? <laughs> he landed right in front of me. Lydia, do you want a crossbow? That's a well-made sword. What is it? 46, no. Lydia, how would you like a crossbow? You seem like somebody that would use Here's one of these. Everything I have. 
And it's an impure. Well, you're, not, you're a Nord. All right, don't go using them all in one place. Let's get going then. You stick, with, you stick with the sword and board. Yo, they smacked him all the way up into the. You know, he was using the space program and landed right in front of me. Thank you. I'm proud of not dying to uh, these giants and minutes. Oh, come on, pick him up. They're looking. We're gonna go have to go past uh, Broken Fan Cave to find this other one. I could have sworn there was one here. Just gotta do a quick once over. Yeah, no, he would have been here. We would we would have seen him. We drop an F5 save here, guys. Well, now you did it. Crash imminent. Yeah, that's likely. Uh, let me go back into the chat here, because I know I missed a bunch of stuff. Um, finally found a character who needed Elemental Fury. Elemental Fury is fantastic, Karma. Um, if you're playing a dual wield character that uses shouts... Slow time, Amulet of Talos, Blessing of Talos. Feel free to use the Dragonborn Shout Overhaul on top of it if you really want to make it fucking OP. Slow time first, you'll be able to go right into your next shout, like almost immediately. Elemental Fury, dual wield. All the dual wield perks, dagger in the left hand, sword in the right hand. It looks fucking cool. <clears throat> I mean, you could put a, a, you could go, you could go mace, go favorite weapon in the right hand, whatever, whatever style you like, but make sure you get a lightweight dagger in the left. Obviously unenchanted. Um, tons of, tons of DPS. It's ridiculous. And uh, you could cut, just kite around the battlefield. Add vampirism into that too, where they have. Um, natural like health buffs like uh, buffs to your strength and speed uh, aside from everything else that vampirism does right yeah how do you clean yeah uh, SSI auto, auto clean yep. I clean that there's no reason not to I, I have a backup of all the CC mods cleaned on my in a folder on my desktop, so that way when I install the game new, like if I'm doing a clean clean wipe and I, I go to I want to reinstall everything, I've got one for the masters, I've got one including the manual edit that you have to make in Dongard. I should say the three edits you have to make in the Dongard manually, um, and then all the CC mods are in a separate folder, depending on which version of the game I'm running. So, just so I don't have to go, because the cleaning product, there's like 40 of them, like there's 75, but like 48 of them need to be cleaned. Even if it's just one ITM, that's one ITM too many. And there's no reason not to clean them with the way that the tools are today. Those, those edits shouldn't be there. They're, they're really on Bethesda for putting out a product that has all this extra crap in it. Um... Next to halt his stream. Uh, the silver ore near the lunar forge. Across from river. Oh. The riverwood one's not there because of JK's riverwood. But we could check this out. So who is it? Was it Vixie that says she wants she wants more trees, like a like more variety? How do you guys think? Like more, I mean, we could do more. I could, I could. It's an almost dead elk. That's a dead elk. 
Oh. All right, let's let's grab him. Come on, Frost. Hey. No, don't wait. Come on, we're going on foot. I think I know where you're talking about. It's down here. Right? Where the hell are they? I hear him yapping at me. Oh, they're, yeah, right there. Did he just take off? Hit you right in the butt. Ugh. I saw you. There it is, 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 there it is. Got him. And I didn't even upset the... That was the most epic kill on a, on a long years. Sorry, boys. God, I love runes. Oh, he's a big boy. One right here, you said, right? Maybe. You would think there would be with all the mud crabs here. I just don't see any. We may have to go down a little further. Let's go, Frost. Come on. Try to save. See, I really like the way that, like, this tundra here looks so good to me. There's no next gen anything. Like, it still has that nice fantasy feel. Oh, and let's get the uh, the hanging moss while we're thinking about it. favorite locations. Dustman's. The tree here. Big burr. Ow. Got him. Good job. Take it, we'll take it. Okay, we want to get all the hanging moss from in here. Is there more? We have to do a lot of alchemy. I need I need my potions. There's two here. Where's the other one? Did I already take it? I missed one. I feel like I missed one. Oh, the undead. Shit. Alright, Frost, you wait. They're gonna pop up. There's gonna. Oh, we need these too. For what's her face? Ingen. Although I should keep them for myself. This place is loaded with alchemy ingredients. Look at this. It's like it's saying something to me. You guys stay here. Ah, 
Ambir's rest. Yeah, you guys are in my fire, that's why. Well, get out of there. Now they're both mad at me. Maybe frozen electrocuted combustion is not a good idea. That's an expert. We can't even pick that. What's the freebie we get here? Ooh, conjuration. Nice. All right. Did we get all the things? Let's go, Frost. So we should have enough to make a ton of potions and make a lot of money. Let's go down here. There's a gold ore vein at the end of this river by, what's this, Green Spring Hollow? In here, this one. Spring Hollow, yep. <sighs> She's got fire on her weapon, too. Kinda makes me wonder if I stuck with Frost, how that would do, how, how that would go over. I gotta say, guys, look at that. We're at 61 frames. I have it locked. Um, performance has been stellar. Ooh, nice, fun guy. Uh, let's knock that one out. Few little things here and there. Cooked beef. Uh, do we want cooked beef? What's that do? 140 stamina. Ooh, it's got other stuff on this. And let's take the brown gloves. We may need them. Ulfred Battleborn's silver necklace. That's from what? Missives? Raw meat? few more things here. Oh, look at this. Pelt Central. Come on, give me that. Uh, Frost. You here? I need to, uh... Down to 162. We're good. No, it really is his hair. So that's from ZZJ's. I think that has a plug-in, though. I can't really change that. I mean, I'm okay with that. What I was talking about is down there. We'll go look down there. I don't want to get ambushed by wolves. And to be fair, we don't really need the pelts. Cleared. Oh, is that going to give me a level? No. Son of a bitch. <gasps> they killed a fox. I'll take the pelt. And I hear... You good, sir. I think so, guys. Why don't you catch a streamer while you're in there?
noticed that. Let's check right here. Yeah, they're usually by these rocks. Well, you know what that means. Torber! Ads! Hold on! Magus, I was right tweeting you. Uh, uh, one death today, I think, right? Just the one? Was it just the one? Yeah, it's been good. It's It's been good. There's Oh, there's a bunch of mud crabs over here. And a big burr. I, I, I don't know why I'm, I'm, I'm getting on. Here, this might be the level up we need, right? Dragon mound. There it is. I see it. Look at that. Okay, so we have 53 skill points to award. Destruction goes, let's see, watch this, ready? I think it's five a piece now. So it should go to what, to 48? Yep. Three, four, five. Well, we needed destruction at 50. Alteration at 40. Here's the question. Alchemy stays at 25. I'm actually okay with this for right now. Later on. I feel like I'm lacking in conjuration. And I know that I said that was going to be one of my main... But between alteration and destruction, I don't really... feel I need much. And they're both at 26. I mean, let's. The question is, should I do enchanting? I don't. I don't feel like I really need enchanting. But I need one perk in it to be able to break some of this stuff down, so I, I could use it. That's a tough call. That's a tough, tough call. We're not gonna use, like we're not gonna use marks and we're not gonna use sneak, we're not gonna use pickpock. Alchemy we are gonna use, twenty five will be fine. We'll eventually get this to fifty. Right? Speech. Speech would be another good one. I would like to get that to fifty as well. Right now between twenty five and thirty, I don't really need it. Resto Maybe. Nothing in this. Right, even for one handed, even though I got like the silver dagger. That's sort of just like a We'll use it to kill things at the end. It's really destruction uh, is the main. Um, I mean, let's get enchanting to f to to twenty five at the very minimum, right? All right, there's eight. We'll save the eight. I can't think of anything I want to put them in right now. And then let's pick. What are we doing? Are we going to go... Health is right at 200. I think we're going to stick with 200 health. And... Maybe later on we'll, we'll toss some more into health. But I, I'm really thinking we stick with Magicka. Because the more Magicka you have, the faster your regen is going to be. Oh, we got two perks. Now let me back out of here. Yeah, there we go. Let's, hey. Adept. What are we getting for fire here? Flame cloak. Fire, well, we need fireball. Steam cloud? What is steam cloud? Snow, oh, I, I'm assuming it's fire. It's a touch spell, right? That can't be right. Well, we're taking Fireball regardless. Torber, you've seen uh, Feral play Requiem enough. Do you know what Steam Cloud is? Has he ever used that? Or any of these? I know what the Venomous Spray is, obviously. But... Yeah, like Lightning Cloak, Fireball... So fireball we're studying. 
Ice Sphere, Lightning Shackles. Steam Cloud. Not to my knowledge. So should we take the Flame Cloak? I think that's a bit much. I don't know if I really want a cloak around my... And we could, we could pick this book up for free. I know where to get this. I'm very curious about Steam Cloud. I also didn't save before I did this. Hold on, I know a guy. <laughs> Always like having a silver dagger or crossbow with burning soul trap on as a finisher. Yeah, yeah, even if I just have, like, I have the silver tanto. I, I have nothing into my smithing. We had just, I had to put a point into the basic, and that was only in order to craft. I wouldn't have been able to craft a steel or a silver dagger if I couldn't. Same way I wouldn't have been able to craft the backpacks, the box pouches, the stuff from like Bandolier, and the cloaks without that very first investment into uh, uh, craftsmanship or smithing. I asked Duff. Wasn't Duff in here? Duff, Duff's been in and out. Wait, that, uh, that doesn't sound right. That's, uh, that's two things. <laughs> I've yet to see him use destruction magic up until now. Interesting. Yeah, he's what? Well, uh, Cause wasn't he fighting Alduin for like the second day in a row? But but this is on his illusionist, right? Like his character is literally an illusionist, which is like the. I'm probably the exact opposite of what the, I usually play illusion style characters. Yeah, illusion. So I've got destruction, alteration, a little bit of restoration, enough to heal, but it's going to wind up being mostly alteration and destruction. I was going to go illusion for like blur. I don't feel like I need it. Although, like I said, one one high level boss with an arrow, and I'm I'm kind of foobard. But we don't have any investment in illusion. I just have the spells up there. Or I'm sorry, the um. Like, we're level 25 plus in Illusion. I just don't have any perks invested. Illusion versus Dragon is not great. At least in vanilla. This is true. This is true, Karma. Yeah, you can't... Without modded... Uh, well, let me think here. Yeah, because Dragons... You, you can't even dual cast, like... Calm or Frenzy in order to get up... Can you calm a dragon if you dual cast it? If you're a vampire with necromage? They're immune. I, I think they're immune. That would be the only way I could see you doing it, Vanilla. Is if you were a necro necromage vampire that used pacify, dual casted, on a dragon after dragon rending him to make him land on the ground, get behind him, and dual attack him with the dagger. With the backstab gloves. That's about the only way I could see you doing it. Otherwise, it's not possible. Modded, of course, yeah, they make uh, damaging illusion spells. They're immune. Yeah, so you can't do it. Only way to calm them is bend will. Interesting. So, bend. you could do bend will... But then you're not really... In, well, because you're shout... But you can add shouts to any build. I really want to see what the steam cloud is. I don't need the cloak. Should we do frost cloak? No. Let's do the steam cloud. I don't know what it is. Right? See, I already... Well, I can't back out of this. I already... What If you try to back out of this, this window doesn't pop back up. You, you lose out on... And then you gotta go spend like four grand on the spell tome. So I kinda effed myself, Karn. <laughs> I keep followers as an illusion mage just so they could deal with dragons. Yeah. I just leave them outside. Well, we'll, fi we'll figure out what Steam Cloud is. Oh, and, and we're gonna get uh, Impact. We could also take Rune Mat. Notice how this is open. But this one's not. 
But it is because you have 50. Or do I get the second rank of Pyromancy? I think we get impact. Intensifying the force of most of your overcharged destruction spells, you're now capable of staggering your foes. It sounds like the Centurion Steam Attack, huh? Oh boy. Let's find out. Holy crap! You're right, it is. 65 damage per second. That just wiped out my magic. Let's see how let's see how much it takes off. This could be useful for Oh, things at a short range. Let's see about the uh there should be a mud crab here. Alright, let's see. Oh, they're dead. Oh, you're not. Ho! Oh. I, um... It's literally the Steam Centurion attack. You can't stop it. Like, if I'm going to just click the button once. Watch this. And then it just does it till your magic runs out. Bravo, Lydia. Bravo. I have the feeling he's not very he's be, not being very genuine. Fireball, huh? Sixty seven? Well, it's less than my rune. That's 144. Yeah, this does 120. It's 22 for 60. And now I don't even need to use that. I could, I could keep the ward up and just cast it. Wow, it takes away a lot of magic. All right, what are we doing? We're looking for juvenile grabs of the mud. I think that's our first Luna Moth. And our first Torch Bug Thorax. Getting lucky with this. Ugh. What's it called again? Steam Cloud? Let's go check out the bandit over here and see what he does. I'll dual cast it at him. Oh, that's actually pretty cool. It wipes my magic right out, but man, that's an instant kill. Oh, good. We'll take that for you. She doesn't like iron, but... We're... Yeah, you can't be wearing that helmet. What's on your mind? Um, trade. Of course, sir. Yeah, that helmet's that helmet's pretty stupid. That's light armor anyway, dummy. Give me that. You like that axe of white run, huh? Alright, you look a lot better, Lydia. Can you found around the huge Yeah, the huge crab car that's well, that's where we're going, Karn. I know they tell you that, but you can also find one right outside of uh White run, which I did. Uh, I just happened to eat him because 
I had just gotten the second perk of alchemical lore. And, uh, you'll learn all four properties. The Fetid Pond. Alright, I'm sorry, it takes a minute to charge, but that is kind of cool. Dwarven Dagger. These are for invisibility potions. Do we have any in here? Damn it. Should we change this up? Let's keep the firebolt for now. I, I, I have all this extra... Imperials. Ah, a shrine of Senator. I think we've already got Zenithar's blessing. It's west of what they say broken fang cave <clears throat> which is like over over here yo Across streams, welcome in. How dare you have free will, silly house, Carl. <laughs> right? We own you. Well, technically not. So... That's actually, um, you can get that. It's there. Sometimes it's underneath. I don't know why that pops up. Vanilla it doesn't do that. Again, I think it's a lot issue messing with it. It's right here, isn't it? Damn it, Lydia. All right, you guys got the other one. Good job. I think the big crab gave birth to a lot of little ones, then died of exhaustion. Having a brood of little nippers must be tiring. Oh, so that's from Beery. All right. mud crab. What a pain in the ass that was. Well, Rorikstead's over there. This is the road, right? 
This is sort of the road-ish. Let's go to Granite Hill. Look at them fighting. Oh, are those all zombies? Oh, they absolutely are zombies. Holy hell. Zombies on my watch. Take your more flesh, though. They're going to keep coming until we do something about it. Ah, oh, shit, and it goes down. You don't hate me, do you? And this is, this is broken fang here, isn't it? Get them all. You... trusts an elk. We should be able to take the vampires on, unless there's a a master in here. In which case, we're probably effed. Let's drop a save. Um, let's go steam cloud. Such a bad idea. Oh, it does it anyway. I thought you could hold it and charge it in your hand. I guess not. Fuck. Elks are menaces. Yes, they are. They're terrible. They're horrible people. All right. Ready? I'm going to try to get this off to get this mist walker that's probably down here. boys. Sorry about that. Yeah, I'm going up here. Ow! Oh, yo! I'm regretting this already. Yeah. Let's not go with the steam and lose all my magic. Let's go with the rune. Ooh, I could double cast the rune, couldn't I? Hey, look. Shut up, Lydia. All right. Uh, fireball put on two. How much does the rune sap? A uh, good amount. All right. We'll, we'll do that. That's fine. What's up, hybrid? What's that? How's it hanging? Now ah! Oh, that worked out nicely with a shout. Hell yeah. Hear him. I knew I smelled Come on. Uh, 
There's two of them. Ow, oh, we're dead. Vampires and Requiem are no joke. I don't know if we have enough to take them on. Uh, finally going to be able to stream tonight, Hybrid. That sounds good. What's, uh... I forget, what was keeping you from doing it, or you just have free time to do it tonight? And win, thank you for this shout-out to Hybrid Avenger. Oh, never you've been lurking all day? Nice. We appreciate lurkers. We we like having you guys in. Never never feel like you have to say anything. If you just feel like hanging out, hang out. I'm cool with that. She likes axes. Yeah, Lydia likes big blunt things. <laughs> Doing some adulting. Yesterday you were just tired. Uh, turkey dinners. Oh, yeah. God, yeah. I had... I, when I took my break before, I had, um... Three, uh, hard-boiled... Well, they're hard-boiled eggs, but they're, you know, Easter eggs. I just peeled them and ate them. With the, with the tiny pinches. I gotta do it with the pinch of salt. Tell me I'm not the only one that does this, right? You, you, you peel the shell off. A little bit of salt. You take a bite. Tiny little bit more pinch of salt. Take another bite until you finish it. It's a, like a guilty pleasure. I never use salt, right? I, I don't use salt on, like, my meals. Um, but on stuff like that, I, I feel like I need to. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. You salt everything. Oh, jeez. Pepper, too, for you, huh? I'll have to try them with pepper. I, had th I only had three. Wind does that, too. So basically, yours is like a hard-boiled deviled egg with the mayo. I was going to say mayto. That must be a California thing, too. Until you corrected yourself, then I realized the Californians are just like regular people. <laughs> you know I'm, you know I'm, uh, I'm busting your butt wind, right? Hopefully you know that. All right. Let's get actually prepared, because I don't know what buffs I have on. So let's let's buff up. What do we have here? Two minutes of the regen, transmute, and four minutes of that. All right, we're good. Let's let's go in. Us Albertans are crazy. Great. Now I want a hard-boiled egg. They're so good. Oh, wow. Oh, she got to be good. I didn't even get a chance to hit her with that. Yeah, we got to use the rune on her. Yeah, the dual, the dual cast rune. Absolutely on her. Otherwise, she wrecks you. And then she drains so fast that it's not even funny. Alright. Can we do this? They're delicious, but a warm soft boiled. Soft boiled is good too. Oh wow. Damn. Alright, we got her. Aw, oh, come on. You little bastards. And there's the boss. And we run. And we hide. And we hide. Shut that off. It's right there. I need to heal myself. I need a good one. And yeah, we need a remarkable stamina. He's in ebony. Look at that. You can see him walking away. Yeah, we're not going to be able to do this. 
And I really can't do with followers. I need, like, to be able to use my runes. Lydia may not be with us much longer. Sorry, Lydia. No, now he's fine. Look at that. Frost is... Alright, so Frost is fine. I think it's the lighting. I think it's coming either from the EMB or it's coming from that. Because Frost looks perfectly fine. Alright. Let's go to Granite Hell. I know when I've been beat. Most days. <laughs> a, we killed a lot of zombies, though. Ah! Another one. No, uh... No Nern Root left behind. Alright, I guess we can go out to foot, right? Take a nice, easy stroll up there. Get a good look at the tundra and the textures. At night, I guess. That's White Run Hold. We're in Falkreath Hold. This is Sky King's Granite Hill. That's not an error. Um, for those that are curious, if you're wondering why if you run northern roads you have floating things, it's because it removes that top mesh. That's the best way I can explain it. I'm probably I'm probably the worst person to explain meshes and textures. Um, if you have blended roads or you're running like the Skyline AO or you're running vanilla roads, that shouldn't be there. I'm almost 100% positive that that's caused by Northern Roads. But I do have a patch between the two. We never figured out the grass issue. I'll show you what I'm talking about. Up here where there's the shops, right? And I've got Granite Hill loaded under my grass mod. I'm running Vadosprum grasses, and I've got a bunch of other stuff too. But, um... I mean, it's, it's not really bad. Stupid dog. I believe he's got an update coming for this. I was in the stream when he was doing the update. There's Roar. Hund. There's John. Yes. Who are you? Me? Oh, I'm just John. Some people call me the mayor of Granite Hill, but officially, I am the emissary for Granite you Hill. You thought I didn't use e &B? Oh no, I'm running e &B hybrid. Unless that wasn't me. Oh yeah, yeah yeah e &B. The community shaders are nowhere close to e &B levels. Yeah, they're just they're flat not. They don't do. And you need like, you need like 10 add-ons, and it still doesn't look anywhere close to half as good as what EMB does. I hope they continue to improve, but here's the problem, by the time that that's caught up, you're going to have a performance hit like you do with EMB anyway. And EMB's got 25 years on the shaders, so. Uh, what's this place? What is this place? Yes. This is Granite Hill. One of the oldest towns in Skyrim. You don't say. What's there to do here? Oh, there is a lot to do here. You can drink and stay at the inn, but keep your hands to yourself because those girls will stab you. There's also an outdoor market, a blacksmith, <laughs> and a general goods store, and we also have an alchemy and a herb shop. Alchemy and an herb shop. Got it. Until next time. Fancy robes. Yes? I am a wizard. <laughs>
It looks really fucking good though. Here, let me turn my lantern off. Look how it looks at night with the lighting. Let's let's get the guards out of the way. I I guess not. Just looks so fucking good. I forgot about Crossway Cottage. This is the player home here. I, I think... I think... I, I gotta... Well, we need the key. We need the key, and I believe there's a... Qu Ooh, juniper berries. We don't have any juniper berries. Uh, I'll take the honeycomb, too. Yeah, we've been picking up alchemy supplies like crazy. Um... Let's get a room for the night, right? Sheep shed in. Sheep's head? Sheep's head. What did I say? Sheep shed. <laughs> Sheep's head. And you know there's a big old head of a sheep right there, Magus. Good job. Somebody send that to Sky King. He'll laugh his ass off at me. John, you coming in the end? We're, we're going in your town's in. Welcome. Let me know if you want anything. Think I got a clean. Come to this town to get somewhere. stabbed. Got it. I mean, well, he said the girls will stab you, Tulia. Need something? Uh, I don't know. Loba. Need something? Uh, what do you do around here? I'm a bard, trained at the Bard's College in Solitude. <laughs> staying the night. Wanderers like you should think about applying. Maybe. Can I make a request? Sure. What can I do for Let's you? Let's see, I don't know what do you know. Uh Humor me. The dragonborn comes. Yes. Okay, thank you. Our hero, our hero. Oh, the, look at the lighting in here. This is fantastic. I tell you, I tell you the dragonborn. I'm obviously gonna turn my lantern on for you guys because it's it's it is dark, but like it. Believe, believe Ms. Layla. Need something. Ooh, you are the innkeeper. What do you have for sale? Drink for the thirsty, food for the hungry. Do you have any, uh... Oh, uh, you don't. Alright, we have 53. Can I sell you? Did I pick up, like, some... No, I didn't. Okay. Mm -hmm. What? Hi there. I need a room for the night, so let me get a room. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. All right, for a day. That works too. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. Thank you. What do you think, Inigo? Uh huh. You have any thoughts? If you want to have a chat, maybe we should take a seat. My tongue wags more when I am not using my legs. All right, fair enough. Okay, let us get back to it. Man, this all looks so good. I appreciate that, man. Well, I'd like to go in there. I, I'd like to chat with the rest of the women, too, if that's possible. And who's this? This is Alex. Come, come. I haven't got all day. Oh, I know about you, Alex. Good to see you. Bjorn the Stoic. A free follower in, uh, Dwarven. Now, not gonna lie, I'm not a big fan of the Dwarven armor. It's gotta be a very specific character that I play. Stay vigilant, friend. And same with, uh, wow, he's got different boots. Interesting. Uh, same for my followers, I almost never put them in Dwarven. Uh, Traveler's Guide to Green Hill, can I, oh, it's stealing. Version, version 3, but, oh. Rick stuff. Long ago, in the first era, Granite Hill was considered under the control of Whiterun, which at that time was ruled by Jarl Gjalland. 
During the first era, the boundaries of White Red expanded much farther than today, and Granite Hill served as a trading town between Solitude, Markarth, Falkreath, and White Run. This is also during the time of the Dragon War that concluded at the top of the Throne of the World. This is where Felder the Old banished Alduin. Also, at that time, the dragon, known as Volchanak, probably mispronouncing his name, was defeated near Granite Hill and was then buried a short distance outside the city gates. The Third Era saw the Imperial Simulacrum, where Emperor, Emperor, Emperor Uriel Septim VII was imprisoned by Jaegar Tharn. Tharn did capture the throne in a short ten years after months of planning. Tharn's possession was the Staff of Chaos, that he had split into nine pieces and scattered across Tamriel. It was the only factor in keeping Uriel Septim trapped in oblivion. A warrior, known as the Eternal Champion, assembled the Staff and defeated Yegar Tharn at the Imperial Palace. The Eternal Champion had, at one point, needed to visit the town of Granite Hill, or Granite Hall as it was known then, to accomplish this task. Today, Granite Hill sees itself again in the midst of chaos. With the Civil War and other aspects, Granite Hill is more important than ever as a major hub of the crossroads between capital holes. Smells like stale beer. <laughs> now considered under the control of Falkreath, this spell, Granite Hill has influenced the court of Falkreath by having an emissary partake in the court. Most days, Granite Hill is quiet with the occasional group of travelers, adventurers, and tradespeople. You could find many interesting shops and sites throughout Granite Hill. There's the open air market, general goods store, potions, and a blacksmith. Legend has it that there's an ancient Nordic ruin somewhere beneath Granite Hill from the first era. Though this is considered legend that the people tell children to scare them from wandering off in fear a draugr would take them. Uh, take them away. Although some have said they've heard noises under oddities and curiosities on numerous occasions, including the owner, Privius. And I don't want to steal it, because I want to be on good terms with the people here. Alright, in it go. Let's... What time is it anyway? 12.37 in the a.m.? Right. Look at our room here. Look at this. We don't want to steal things. You want to relax, Sinigo, or what? I mean, I'm going to get some rest. Did you guys see the new Noble Bed mod? That's out. Granted, there's only like it one... Nice and warm there's there. one color for it. Well, there's like one theme color for it. Um, it looks pretty good. That's the second thing. Somebody remind me at the end of stream. Uh, turn back your engine fixes uh, sleep late time to normal. So it doesn't speed up. I only do that because um, in Requiem, Requiem already adjusts your, uh, your game time. So I don't want anything fucking with it. Alright, morning. Save. The stream is live in seven hours. Yeah, it looks like I lied about that one, guys. I said we weren't going to go that long. Alright. Let's go out and do some trading here. So the ladies will stab you, huh? I don't want to get stabbed by ladies. Uh, Sunfin Birdie. Welcome in. Sorry I missed it. Let me go back up here. I know I missed a bunch of chat reading the book, so we're talking about charged. deviled eggs, hard-boiled eggs, soft-boiled eggs. Hybrid doesn't like the hard yolk. That could mean two things. Uh, then Sunfin Birdie came in and said hi. Hi. I like the Dwemer armor that Fourth Unknown did a while back. I'll have to look that one up, James. I think I know what you're referring to and I may have downloaded it but it's been a while I like the ethereum armor that comes from that mod that's an add-on for like legacy 
Oh, here comes the rain. This ought to be good. Let's see what Granite Hill looks like in the rain. I mean, it looks like, you know, a regular town in the rain, but... Alright, um... Frost, we're gonna, we're gonna park you over here. Alright, well, you just wait right in the middle of town, I guess. It got dark real quick. Let's go visit the Dragon Mound. We haven't done that yet. This is where he's buried, huh? Alright. We are getting wet. Yeah. This tool of beer. Oh, he's also a smithing trainer. That's interesting. Already learned all I can do. Really? Maybe he's not. Looking to protect yourself? I don't know. Let's see what he's got. Oh, yeah. Stamina, health, minor wielding. Oh, yeah. So. Wait, what? I yeah. sold him something else by accident, didn't I? Looking to protect yourself or feel some damage. No, maybe I didn't. All right, thank God. All right. You have anything in it, go? I hope the babies are welcome. But they sound like they could be a stunning bunch. What is yours is mine. Okay, let us get back to yes, it. Yes, okay. I am sworn to carry your burdens. So she is using those, huh? All right, we're going to have to make her some bolts. There is a smelter over here. With garlic in it for some reason. I'm not complaining. Um, is there a wood chopping block? Is the question. We'll have to figure that out. I don't remember. Yeah, it may be over here in the market. It's Jennifer here. She's got some raw beef, which we are taking. All right. Aisha. So your weapons and armor too, huh? Well, since Lydia is going to be with us. This is an upgrade for Inigo. 
That's a big upgrade for Inigo. That's expensive. Same with the boots. That's a whole extra 100 points. You know what's going to happen? I'm going to buy this. And we're going to... No, you know what? You know what I got? I have one potion of barter. I'll take that 6%. Go. You get an upgrade. Chin lighting? What do you mean? Oh, I have my lantern on. It's just normal. My, my lantern's on so you guys can see them. They're they're otherwise normal. Uh, another secret. Interesting. I could have sworn there was a wood chopping block here. I must be nuts. Or just not remembering where it is. Is it by the? It's by the player home. along the side here. Maybe this is not. You know, it's common in Feral's game, too. Yeah, no, it's just... Like I like I said, I, I've, I've got quick light, so... Pop that in. Yeah, from what I remember, this one's getting a major overhaul. He wasn't happy with it. I, uh... I got to be in the stream to just kind of hang out and watch, and, like, the, the transformation that this shop has gone under uh, is amazing. Uh, you're previous. Yes. That's with my light off. Uh, what do you have for sale? Hmm. I had you figured for a mage. I you did. Okay, let's see what you have. Expert robes of all. Oh my god. Why can't they be destruction? I may buy this for the hell of it. Look at them. I know they're green. And we have Apprentice of Resto. We do use Alteration a lot, though. And it does take a good chunk. Uh, I have the money for it, too. 
What do you guys think? That's a nice green, isn't it? Expert, mate. We're never gonna find these again. And I don't like those. I don't like the mantled robes. I like these. What do you, do you guys think I should pick these up for uh, only 2100? Really, it's not that bad. For an extra, jeez. We've got illusion, an extra 150 magic regen on top of it. Plus, we actually use alteration spells. It matches his eyes. Yeah, you had me. It matches his eyes. <laughs> Arcane missile. Uh, let's see what else he has. The elemental bolt, burst, flare. Spending money that I shouldn't be. I still think I should pick up strangulation. I don't want to be spending on the money yet. Now I don't have any money. Now, if you'll excuse me. Now, previous. I do like the blood, though. Let's take the hood off. Oh, yeah. Let's get away from the stuff so you can actually see it. Look at that. Oh, that's good. A little clipping with the, uh, you know. But, hey. I'll take it. Um, curiosity. I forget how this quest started. Yeah, it, it, the it's these are Zav's robes retexture. I thought you could ask him to investigate, because you need the key to get in there. Does he have the key in the shop? I thought he had it on him. He's got his house key. There's just a sword and some money. Ooh, 80 per... Wow. And since we don't have anything in enchanting, I can't break anything down. Which kind of sucks. Actually, wait a minute. I can still break this down, I just can't use it. Well, we still have the enchantments, is the question. Because I did get a lot of stuff out of my inventory. I think you need the first perk. It's like lockpicking. You can't, you can't do it and... You've acquired fundamental insights into how matter and magic intertwine. Thus, you can now infuse items with arcane energy at an enchanter and use soul gems to recharge items of all kind. I don't know if we would even go into this at this point. Previous, you don't have anything Make else? Quick. Can you train me an enchant? No, he can't. You've already learned all that. This is coming up because uh, it's a modded town and it needs a... This actually needs a patch for Requiem. Now if you'll excuse me. Where is your key, Sir Previous? It's not in there. Not on the mantle. Is it on the mantle? Let's see Harkonian mail. Let's check the wardrobe. I don't think it's in here. I don't think it's above there. Ah, oh, shit. 
You won't get away with that. Sorry. Wrong, uh, wrong place. Yeah, now he's not gonna trust me. Right, let me drop a save. Let's see if I can do this. Yeah, he's looking at me, isn't he? Don't I have a pickpocket one here? Yeah, you go sit down again. Yeah. Let's try this. Zero percent chance to steal. Because they don't have anything in... Oh, what a waste. We'll just... I want that potion back. So it wouldn't matter. Did it not load? Oh, we're back at the... Never mind. We overwrote 113 with 140. Alright, so... Think about it. Doesn't matter. All right, we lost it. Let's go. Let's go have a talk with Alex. Alex is the next shop down. Kind of has a link thing going on. You think so? I mean, yeah, I guess I can see that. I love this potent potables. It's been so long since I've used this. Yeah, yeah, you got a lighting issue here. What's up, Alex? Make it quick. What have you got? So, you're interested in my potions and ingredients? Yeah, it depends. <laughs> what we need to do is take all this stuff off and make some of our fucking money back. He's got 710. Got an alchemy lab right there. Yeah, Granite Hill may need a uh, requiem patch. Let's see if we can make some potions and at least make some of our money back. Man, Frost, I'm I'm lazy. You have all my stuff. Yeah, there's no take all, unfortunately, with this, so. Stop raining. Light looks better. A little too misty in here for my liking. All right, you you do that. I'm gonna I'm gonna hang out here. We like doing green things. Green spells. Alright, that's a little bit better on the magic. Alright, anything else I can munch on? Sound very good. All right. 
Alex, I uh, need to use your alchemy lab, good sir. Uh, let's make the good potions for me. Uh, restore magic. Elves ear, ten for twenty seconds. Is that the best we can get? Should be right. Yes. So we can make what seventeen of these. Ten for twenty seconds. Okay. Uh, restore health. Actually, we need to restore stamina. Stamina regens 38%. Uh, so, no, we don't want the regen. Poison of... No, 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 no. 19 for 20 seconds. That's enough. One, two, three, four. Mud crab and B. 5. 10. That's pretty good, too. And then what's the last one? What do you need? Health? I'm not using my Nern root. I also don't want to use the hearts. Let's make some of them for the hell of it. Uh, blue butterfly wings, blue mountain flower, hanging moss. 222. The Mort Flesh. 213. What if I add wheat? Or salt? No. We got six left. Jeez, uh, what else is good? The barter one. Carry weight. 31 for 300 seconds. Drains the target's health. How about no? Do we, do we make restore health? I don't remember. Doesn't seem like I did. Ten for twenty seconds, huh? That's a big boy. Bear heart and glowing mushroom. Nerners are the only thing. So let's see what, how much money we can make off these guys. I think there's a couple vendors, Alex being one of them. Come, come. I haven't got all day. Alex, we need to uh, so, make some money back here. In my potions and ingredients. Yeah, we spent it all next door at Privius's establishment. Oh, you know what? Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. Mm -hmm. Need something? Yeah, yeah. Ah, so you're an alchemist. Yeah, I try to be. 900, huh? He can't buy all that. There. You got 28, huh? Frenzy. You got 20. 
jumps can it make? Uh, we'll keep water breathing. All right, he's only got 20 something. We get, we made some money back. That's not bad. All right. Until next time. Yeah, yeah. Uh, let me do this. Uh, we're coming up on eight hours. I'm ho I was hoping to get the home. Let me let me look it up real quick. It's been a while since I've done this. I don't even know if it's going to explain or if he's got it in the spoilers, but... Granite Hill. Uh, filtered by endorsements. This is the first one, for obvious reasons. Uh, fully loaded player home with the ability to move your family in. So, before you update, uh, if you use it, remove all items, blah, 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 blah. We're on version 6.0. Fixed dungeon bust, spawning issue, fix faller issues in dungeons, always aggro. Uh... Player home is now compatible with multiple home adoptions, allowing for wife, two kids, reworked lighting on all interiors, reworked lighting on exterior, rebuilt nav mesh inside in. Doesn't really say. I'm assuming you have to talk to Privius. But he's not giving me any dialogue. Oh, so the the training thing isn't a uh, <clears throat> it's not a requiem thing. He apparently did this for all the trainers and doesn't know why. You have to remove them from the training faction. He literally just posted this on the 22nd of March this year. Yeah, I have the same issue, but with all the trainers in the game, I'm not sure what's up. <laughs> I've not touched the trainers in a long time. They worked, now they don't. So I'm not sure if it's the mod or the game. Uh, it's the NPCs specifically from the mod. You have to remove them from the from the faction. I know that I've made I've made so many of them. <laughs> 